<laughs> Good evening, jammers, and welcome to the JNC podcast. I'm your host, Brad Brock, and may the fourth be with you uh, because it is Star Wars Day. The sci fi masterpiece and pop culture phenomenon started uh, just a few years ago in uh, 1977. <laughs> since the uh since the first film release uh an entire franchise uh was born continuing on into today with major feature films television series video games and uh even theme park attractions so tonight we're celebrating all things star wars with some fun games trivia uh, perhaps a competition so on and so forth but uh, let's hear it uh, for tonight's destruction crew. Of course, we have uh, Her Royal Highness, who <laughs> I had it written as Princess Jordan, but it, but you guys, it's Yoda. <laughs> <laughs> That's Jordan. 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 <laughs> uh, and our resident Sith Lord, Darth the Bruce. <laughs> Sacrilege. <laughs> and our very own Qui Gon Zugol. Oh, 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 or Chew, Chewbacca. They chose their own characters tonight. Chew some Tabaka. I don't know. Was there any Wookiee? Were there any Wookiee Jedis? Uh, yes, there were. Oh, well, good to know. Something Not until you know. a new hope. That's yeah. Yeah, perhaps in, in book number forty two released in <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, nerd. Uh you got him. Uh you guys, thank you so much for tuning in live with us tonight on YouTube and Facebook. And a thanks to those of you catching the show later on your favorite podcast platforms or watching us on our free jams and cocktails Roku channel. Please like, share, follow, and subscribe wherever you are tuning in. Uh before we punch this show into hyperdrive. Ha ha ha! Saw what you did there. <laughs> yeah, let's uh, let's check out our shot of the week. I mean, I did not mix right. It's Korean. There's no baby Yoda. His name is Grogu. Well, you guys, it's the Drunken Yoda. That's the name of the shot this week. This little green shot is a sweet treat and will put you on your ass in 12 parsecs. Uh, it is Can one. Can you par- read it in your Yoda voice? Uh, that's coming later <laughs> oh, okay. in the show. <laughs> ass be put on. <laughs> one part vodka, one part Midori, two parts sour apple pucker. <laughs> One part blue curacao and one part sour mix. It gives you um, gives you this beautiful shot. You shake it in ice and you strain it to a shot glass, and it's lovely. This is this is Yoda Green, guys. Yoda, Yoda, Yoda Green, very green. So cheers to you here in the lounge. Cheers, cheers to you guys listening live with us. Oh, tastes like a damn Jolly Rancher, right? That's really good. Yeah, that's a winner. It mm. does taste like a Jolly Rancher, yeah. doesn't it? Oh mm-hmm. yeah. Nice. Yeah, well, join us each week for our Shot of the Week by visiting jncpodcast.com, clicking on the Shot of the Week link and seeing what we're planning. Then get everything that you need delivered to you by our friends at Drizzly. 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 (laughs) Drizzle, drizzle, drizzle. Drizzle, drizzle, drizzle. All right, we're going to dive right into our Star Wars chat here. I just have some questions for you guys. Um, Now. I know it's fair. Uh, everyone has their starting point when it comes to Star Wars, so uh, we're gonna we're gonna discuss a little bit about uh, our very first dive into this galaxy. And this includes any of you out there tuning in live with us. Please chime in uh, on any experiences that you had in Star Wars and um, answer the questions yourself uh, out there in Internet Land. But uh, I guess I'll go around the room. Um, I guess uh, as the eldest member of the cast tonight. Okay, great, Brad. I'll go first. Uh, (laughs) (laughs) Nice. Nice. (laughs) All right. Uh, Darth the Bruce. um, What was your first introduction to Star Wars? Well, a long time ago, before any of you even existed, (laughs) I saw A New Hope. But back then it wasn't called A New Hope. It was just called Star Wars. Just Star Wars, right? There was no such thing as A New Hope. And saw it at a drive-in movie theater in Lake Worth. And we were, me and my cousins, we were on the top of a 
custom van that was Uncle Joey's. Oh, yeah. It yes. was called the Starship. <laughs> and we were all up on there with blankets and everything, and that's where we saw the first movie. That's awesome. What was your what that's was like- your reaction to that? What did you uh did it blow your mind? Oh man, it was the coolest thing ever. I was a little kid, man. It was the coolest thing ever. And then you got thousands of dollars worth of toys for Star Wars for Christmas. I always thought that it was fascinating yeah. how George Lucas monetized and, oh. and merchant made merchandise out of the uh, out of it. It's incredible. That's where all the money was made. Yeah, of course. <laughs> of course. It's amazing. Um, all right, Derek, what uh what was your first introduction into the Star Wars galaxy? Well, I saw VHS. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, yeah. That's um, the one I so, yeah. <laughs> um the first time I remember watching it was on a VHS tape that we got from Blockbuster Video. Oh, What's yeah. Blockbuster? Yeah. Damn. For those young children that are still out there, um that is the prelude to Redbox, which is the prelude to Netflix. So um, we used to actually have to go somewhere to buy video or rent videos and and pray it was and in then, stock. Then we because then we had to rewind them or we got charged extra. There but, was no internet. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> so uh, we we rented it and we watched uh, New Hope and um, yeah, I became a huge fan. Um, <laughs> until uh they went back and did prequels. Uh-huh. 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 CGI so, quills. <laughs> so um w- when you when you watched it for the first time on VHS was it was it was this a time where they had done the 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 remasters or they had no. added all the stupid characters and, and things in there? No, this was not the remastered version. This was the original. I was original theatric. Yeah, I was uh, probably 4 and uh crazy yeah it, it the things that they have done to it since break my heart <laughs> they, I, yeah, I hear you oh, yeah. break my heart <laughs> I hear you. leave the originals alone <laughs> yeah treat them like britney leave her alone there was something leave her alone. there was something much better when they used models of the ships as opposed to cgi yeah i feel like that was that's yeah. an art form that yeah. uh that was lost in that that early 2000s time when they started you know re re everything was invigorating (laughs) yeah (laughs) well and my family i my mom was a big star trek fan Mm -hmm. so um that's the one with spock jordan yeah that's oh okay that's the one yeah 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 yeah, with genghis khan yeah and the shatner (laughs) and the shatner and the shatner um so we, we we used to watch those movies as well as the TV shows that were on. And then when this came out, it kind of took that to a whole new level. And it was just, it was my Star Trek. It, wow. Star Wars became my Star Trek. Yeah, I dig that. What about uh, what about you, Miss Jordy? Oh. What was your uh, first dive into the Star Wars universe? Well, mine is lengthy. So before I tell my story... Uh, Linda wants to know, um, uh, Dark Lord yeah. dude, how old you were when you saw it uh, at the drive-in? Would you say nine, okay. eight? What was it? 70, 70, 77 was oh, when it was 77? released. Seventy-seven. Then no, I was six. Okay, a little, little, little kid, a little, little, yeah. little baby, a little, little nug nug. Okay, little nug nug. So. My first time seeing Star Wars was in high school. <laughs> we, what? The? Well, I was late to the party. I, I didn't think it would be my cup of tea, but I took Jordan a- was in high school in 1977. That's so yeah. yeah. So it was the year it came out. Um, and I took a film and lit class and we had to watch different categories of movies. And one of them had Star Wars A New Hope in it. But the thing that sucked was that the film and lit class was my last class of the day. And obviously that whole category just, you know, put old Jordan to sleep. So I didn't really watch too much. Um, she saw the rolling credits in the beginning and that was it. Yeah, basically. She was, and then it was like nap time. Because I was, was like, it's, it's like it. one in the afternoon. Yeah, like we're, we're napping now. I've been up since like 5 a.m. Um, but and also an embarrassing tidbit about me. We'll never forget. Uh, so you obviously after every movie you watched in that class, you had to take a little test, you know, like a 10 question or whatever on the movie and things from it. And I was like, fuck. Oh, God. And one of the questions, the answer was, and I 
mental note made was the lightsaber, but I put life Life saver. (laughs) And then my teacher in red pen was like, candy question mark and i was like damn it it's like well whatever the thing is the the, the thing the, 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 the laser the, the, doohickey the, the, the thing the yeah. thing the, 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 the little thing here yeah so then i was like oh shit and then i actually just watched all of them what was it like two years ago and now probably with you yeah well we started so what had happened the first was time ever, is, the uh, is we watched you know d- during the lockdown we, we we ended up binge watching season one and two of the mandalorian and uh and Jordan was kind of hooked because, you know, everybody loved baby, baby Yoda. Uh, Goku. Grogu. Grogu. Yes. yes. Goku. Goku. Yes. <laughs> From Go- Dragon Ball Go- Z. Wrong universe. <laughs> Gogurt. <laughs> so I was like, well, now that you've dipped your toes in the uh, in the water here, we need to like go back and we need to start. Put it all together. Put it all together. So we did. We started back at the New Hope. She had never seen any of the prequels or the sequels of, for this matter. So did you well, start with New episode, Hope in high school? You started so, with yeah. episode four. So we did. We you started. didn't start with one. No, no. So when you, I feel like you're and it missing all made out. sense. It was nice. And then oh. also early memory was at 7-Eleven and stuff they had because obviously I was a young in when the prequels or the new whatever right, came yeah, out. The prequels, yeah. yeah. And um, I, right now. I the, do you, does anyone remember at 7-Eleven and stuff? They had like the cups you could get they with the, the little lids heads and, stuff, yes, and, they were and the awesome. straws were actually lightsaber. Yeah, I wanted <laughs> life ah, saver life saver. <laughs> I wanted the Natalie Portman Queen one so badly. I had no idea who any of them were, but they were so cool to <laughs> the have. Natalie the Natalie Portman, Portman Queen, Queen one. one. What? <laughs> is that not what it is? And what was her name? A Queen Amidama. Yeah, yeah yes, yes. <laughs> Aniba. I'm going to give it to her. Yeah. <laughs> Queen, Queen half a dollar. Considering yes. the way she says bidet. <laughs> Bid it. <laughs> Amidama is really good. Hey, hey my only question is. When did she start wow. to get upset while watching all of the movies, realizing there was no baby Yoda? I yeah, know. yeah. In any that of the films. Was, yeah. Was, yeah. There was just well, old I did Yoda. Know that, but there was Hayden Christensen, so that was okay. So you're telling Kinda me. Kind of like a baby Yoda. Yeah. You're telling me that you have been so forced burned off. to watch Star Wars twice. Yeah. Twice? Yeah. You were forced to watch it in high school, and now you're forced to watch it with Brad. Well, I kind of no. She wanted, wanted to. the force, brother. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, yeah. There you go. You want to watch? She, <laughs> yeah. she did. This she wanted is to watch the movies. You want to watch? And then so I got that Natalie Portman Queen Amidama <laughs> cup. Um, um, <laughs> queen half a dollar. <laughs> half yes. a dollar. We got it. Um, and I feel like you had to get a specific drink to get it. Like I know. Mine specifically was like Diet Pepsi or something. And I was like, I hate Diet Pepsi. So I literally made my parents buy me it. I poured the drink out in the parking lot and kept the cup and oh. like <laughs> moved on with life. I would have spanked your ass. Yeah. I was like, no. Brilliant. Yeah. You she just wanted the Amidama. I just wanted the cup. You would have felt the force. Yeah. <laughs> and so, yeah, that. So, and I'm sure my mom still has the cups. We'll right, so we look. still have quite anyway. a bit of films to get through because we did not get through a lot of them. We, we started to lose steam a little bit. The, yeah, we got to yeah. like Rogue One, I think, right? We watched Rogue. Well, stop there. Wait, are you one. watching it in? Yeah, like we watched the, the original. Order? We watched the original trilogy. Okay, and then we watched the prequels. We, we watched the prequels, and then we watched went Rogue to Rogue one. one. Because what? Okay, so there are some people, and there's two sides of this. Some people believe that we live in an age now where if you're just getting into the universe, you should start at one and go. Th- and you know, or you know, and and run through. You go through the prequels. You go through Rogue One. You go through four, five, six, and then you do the sequels. Mm-hmm. You know, and in there, you should be watching Clone Wars and all Don't the television Solo. shows. And yeah, any of those. You know, mm-hmm. there's a timeline for it. But I feel like because I still live in nostalgia, that you miss out on all the little nostalgic things they put in those future films yes. that make you go. Ah, those aha moments that you wouldn't get if you were just watching them straight through. Now, you, so I feel like there's a there's a very interesting dynamic that people, you know, you I only agree. get to experience yeah. one. Now, I you, agree. Watching in the original, you should start with the new filmed one. order is the right way to go. But I think it would be interesting if you have the time to watch it in um, chronological order. Mm-hmm. That that'd be pretty interesting to see how, how much it changes things. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Not that I've ever done it. <laughs> <laughs> you were in them. Shut up. Oh. All right. So we, we have a. Yeah, that was a fun use of lockdown time. 
And I will Many say, you know, obviously, like, you know, at my age, I, I I saw A New Hope and, I, you know, the original trilogy, but I was young and wasn't really like taking it all in. I would say that the prequels were my generation's Star Wars. That oh, was our our Star Wars, you know, so like, you know, we, then our generation sucked. Uh, as far I as mean, Star Wars. I don't know, man. Yeah. I used to skip it. school in high school to go and watch uh, Attack of the Clones. You used to skip school no, in high school. The, for pre- the prequels everything. were bad. What Disney's done to it. Yeah, at least George Lucas had a hand in the prequels. Good God. <laughs> but anyway, um, coming to that point, what is what is everybody's favorite film in the series so far? Uh, and this is not television shows or anything. This is actually just the feature films. Uh, Derek. Oh, me first. You, wow. You first. Um, my favorite. Uh, so does that mean the, probably, the nine? The nine movies? Yes. Yeah. Oh, so not counting Rogue One, not counting Solo. No, no. All the any feature uh, film. Okay. I think I really enjoyed Solo. I thought it was good, too. I, 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 I really enjoyed Solo. But. Uh, probably. I mean, I'm I'm an old softy when it comes to the way things are supposed to be, and I I liked Return of the Jedi, the episode, th- the original episode three. Right, right, right. Where the good guys where win. where Luke finally comes out. Well, where Darth Vader finally. I don't want to give anything away. And, and <laughs> no spoiler alerts. Come, I didn't say it. Tell us the truth. It's Carrie Fisher in the little bikini, and first time you felt the Force. <laughs> that body was banging. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Banging. Oh, I was thinking more of C three. Well, the funny thing, she was only like seventeen oh years old. What just movie. happened? Oh my yeah, god, she wait. Was really yeah. Hold on, I'm sorry. What just so happened? So my favorite character of all times, besides obviously Baby Yodi. If you say Jar Jar, I'm gonna throw something. At you. No, no, no. No, wait, no, no. we're not there yet. Oh wait, but I. We're not on. We're not there yet. Oh, you're gonna ask that question. Yes. Okay, then I'll wait to make this comment. My gosh, okay, I'm sorry. Read, I, well, read my I, notes. Jumping ahead. Overachiever. Well, I just saw the cutest thing ever, and I have to. Oh, okay. Lord uh, have mercy. Perfect. Sorry. <laughs> right. Sorry. Anyway. Uh, all right. Uh, Steve the Bruce, what was your favorite uh, feature film in the series, including uh, including the side quests and, and, and you know, or origin stories and whatnot? Oh, it had to be The Empire Strikes Back. Go figure. I think, I think that was the coolest one. I agree. I, yeah. I, if I, that, I guess I'm going with mine too. Uh, if I, if I had to, I think Empire Strike Back because you know, for, for a series of hero movies and especially coming right off the heels of a new hope and all of a sudden the movie ends and, and the good guys didn't win. Yeah. yeah that was heartbreaking. That was awesome. Yeah. And, uh, you know, and first uh, cliffhanger, right. But it that's, was, it was crazy. First major cliffhanger. But that's through most of star Wars through all the films. Sure. The yeah. Good guys don't always win. Yeah. I loved it. Yeah. I loved it. empire was empire was good. Second, my second, and and I guess in that same vein was actually Revenge of the Sith. I thought it was, you know, maybe it could have been played a little better, but I thought it was an interesting to see this impressionable man who was impressionable for, you know, just get kicked around literally his whole life. And then, you know, the age old story of somebody being like, you don't need these people. Come with me. I will give you everything that you need, you know, and it's. Pure indoctrination. Yeah, exactly. What it's it was. crazy, you know. So I, you know, good guys didn't win at the end of Revenge of the Sith, did they? No, no. they lost in a What's big up, way. Jordan? Which one did I like best? <laughs> That's a good question. Well, it it is a good question, but it's not a fair question because she hasn't seen. She hasn't them seen them all. Yeah. Which one? What True. have you liked so far? You can include the. The Mandalorian, if you liked that. <laughs> so that's yeah, what I was gonna say, but then you said the movies. So I don't know. I, I guess kind of just the the New Hope one was pretty good, or the I don't know. Have you guys um, seen know. trailers for the new Obi Wan? I have, but I'm kind of yeah. like not wanting to watch them because I I just want to be a I just want to be surprised. I also, yeah. I also feel like Derek. Why did you hate the the Hayden Christensen ones? I didn't think they were awful. <laughs> Yeah, he's such a great actor. <laughs> oh. I don't understand it. And Natalie Portman. Listen, I think, is this a real question? I, right thought now? Were, I thought they were good. I think if the films would have been made in a different way, that uh, it could have been a lot better. Maybe if it was, I mean, it was a little more, pra- yeah. more practical well, sets and, and I, things like that. I can see where Jordan would think they were really good. I mean, she's You'd basically my car? well, you, well, no, you, uh, I mean, no, we no, no. On a serious note, you've watched sci. The only sci-fi movies you've ever watched have been just dosed with special effects. Yeah. So that amazes a well, lot of people. Well, I like the storyline. I liked the whole little mm-hmm. romance of, you know, uh, 
An- uh, Anakin and yeah. Queen the fa- Lamy The fall Donna. of the Republic <laughs> and the murder Padme. of everybody. And a, it was the romance. That I yeah, of course. You got to pull <laughs> yeah. them in with the romance. Yeah, the romance got me. <laughs> All right. So we'll, we'll come to uh, Jordan's question she's been dying to ask and uh, or dying to answer. Who is your favorite character in uh, in the franchise? And you could begin, Jordan. Okay, thank you. Um, so my favorite is obviously Baby Yoda, but besides that <laughs> is Greedo. <laughs> oh, Greedo! Oh. Yeah, he's so cute. And <laughs> so cute. As I was googling, so Romians are so cute. Because okay, he was in the New Hope, right? That was like yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, he shot first. So that was. Yeah what I was trying to Google and then it's so cute. They have an article that says Greedo and then it says Wikipedia. And I thought that it was the cute. cutest thing I've ever. Okay. Anyway. Yeah. So Greedo. <laughs> All right. Steve, the Bruce favorite character. Uh, probably surprised a lot of people. I liked a Jenner or so. No. Yeah. Jenner. So yeah. yeah, she I was, uh, she was a cool, she had an interesting character arc. Or, yeah. or backstory that we got to learn way later. She was cool. Interesting. She was a a strong female, but it wasn't like a Mary Sue. She wasn't like all powerful and everything. She was just a true strong person, a strong character. Yeah. Generous O? J- J- Jin, Jin or Urso. Urso. Oh. <laughs> Jordan's doing homework right now. <laughs> what about you, Derek? Um, When looking at the entire, in the entirety of all of it, um, I mean, I can joke around and say it was obviously Chewbacca because he was a man of so many words. And um, what was your favorite word that he said? <laughs> yeah, that was a good one. That was a great line. It was a great line. It, it was ad libbed. Honestly, <laughs> he made that up himself. Um, but no, Han Solo. Han Solo okay. is is the man always has been just his his witty comebacks his um comedic timing i mean harrison ford was fantastic they picked the right person for that and um that made for my favorite character yeah uh, the the best anti-hero yes. i think ever oh yeah oh yeah Absolutely. <laughs> because even when He's he came thief. back when yeah. he came back in the in the sequels man he was still just up to his old shit yep. you know mm-hmm. like ran away from the war and was just stealing stealing ships you know? <laughs> gotta make some money yep <laughs> ultimate pirate <laughs> Shame. We had we had uh, somebody uh, in in uh, YouTube say that there's a character favorite character was R two D two. Hey, there we go. Oh. Living little, around here in the room somewhere, little Kenny Baker. <laughs> oh, or Joan Rivers as. No, no, that was Spaceballs. I know. Female C C R two D two dot matrix. Uh, you want to know? Some... You want to know a little bit of trivia about R two D two on three CPO? Sure. The two actors hated each other. No kidding. Passion. Kenny Baker and Anthony Young hated well, each other with a passion. Well, that was great because it really, that chemistry really yeah. spilled over into yeah, their love-hate hate relationship. You could tell in their voices that they yeah. really, you could hear the contempt. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Who was your favorite, Bradford? Uh, my favorite character, believe it or not. Uh, Jar Jar Binks. It I'll wasn't throw, Jar Jar Binks. I'll throw a bottle at him. <laughs> no, uh, it was, uh, I... Really, really liked uh, Qui Gon Jinn. Uh, oh yes, I thought he was just like a rebel. You know, no pun intended. Like, but like a rebel of the Jedi. You know, like he wouldn't get on the council because he was just. You know, he they offered it to him, but he wouldn't take a seat on the council because you know he just was too edgy. You know, and wanted to be out there doing things, and uh, and like he was just so wise and he gave after he died he gave all the other jedi the ability to come back as force ghosts yes he did so like i don't know his character and then you know of course like lived on through through the television shows and you know um so i i I really thought they slighted him in the first episode yes um when they when they killed his ass but um (laughs) well (laughs) and i mean the the actor that played qui-gon jinn um liam neeson Liam Neeson. No. Yeah, yeah, you Liam got Liam Neeson. Neeson. Yeah, I, I love Liam Neeson. It and everything he he does. So, for them to take him out so quickly really upset me. I have a unique set of skills. <laughs> he, yes, he I did. Could come back as a force ghost. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that was my favorite character. And now I, I have one more question. 
before we get into some uh, some Star Wars trivia. Uh-huh. Um, the R2-D2, just so everybody knows, sorry, um, that is a new friend of ours, Megan. Oh, hi, Megan. Hey, Megan. She's hey, watching Megan. from Georgia right now. Georgia. Oh, Georgia. Georgia. Georgia's on our mind. <laughs> awesome. R2-D2 lover, right? Yes. Um, just for you. <laughs> all right, so this is a question for you guys and anybody uh, listening in with us. Um, and I'll start, I guess I'll start with Derek. Again? Yeah, Derek, why do you hate Jar Jar Binks? Wow. Why do I hate Jar Jar Binks? Um, maybe because his character was so true to form for government. But, um, <laughs> God. We had that discussion earlier, just saying. <laughs> um, Senator, no, Senator Binks. Sen- yeah. Representative. He was a representative, oh, no. not a senator. Um, I just, it was needless. I mean. I think it was egregious. I think it was, yeah. Anyway. No, egregious, egregious was in another film. Oh, yes, yes. He was a <laughs> general. General He was a general, not a senator. General egregious. <laughs> um, no, it just, it was, it was a waste of, they could have done so much more with a character like that, and it just. It didn't add to the story. It didn't really take away. It just seemed like a waste. Yeah. What about you, Steve the Bruce? Why do you hate Jar Jar Binks? <laughs> how, much time, oh, how much time is the podcast? <laughs> no, it, it was their ill attempt at putting some kind of comedy relief like R2-D2 and 3CPO used to be. And they just missed the mark by mm-hmm. so much. By so much. He, it shouldn't have been, he shouldn't have been an all CGI character because it looked horrible. And just it it just didn't flow good with anything that was going. This those movies were extremely serious movies and dark movies for Star Wars, really dark. And to try to put this comedy skit in the middle of it, that it just failed on so many levels. I mean, it really did. I agree, Jordan. What about uh, what about you? Why do you hate Jar Jar Binks? Do you hate Jar Jar Binks? Who's Jar Jar Binks? Uh, yeah, I'm not educated enough on the topic to have an informed decision. He I was, thought he was cute with the big floppy ears and swimming around. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. I uh, I hated him based <laughs> kind of a combination of what you guys say. Like, I, I think it was needless. Mm. Uh, I think being a complete CGI character, it was just it, it just wasn't the time for that technology yet. No. Um, and uh, and yeah, it just seemed a little pointless. What about you guys out there? Why do you hate Jar Jar Binks? You, Let us know. Would you arguably say that he's the most hated, disliked character by all Star Wars fans in the whole galaxy? I, I think Ray is now the most hated yeah. Star oh. Wars yeah. character. Yeah. Passed, yeah. passed up Jar Jar, Yeah, huh? Jedi Mary Sue. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dang, why? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. She hasn't been, wasn't trained in any way, shape, or form. And but then, she's the strongest and then Jedi Because out there. she's yeah. the most perfect Jedi ever. She is the Jedi. She is well, all the okay. Jedi. She's everybody. You guys can't be hating on the best Jedi ever. Uh, yeah. You yeah. Like, do you they like didn't say she was the best training. Jedi. She's, she is all the Jedi. She's, yeah, she's just uh, everything. No. Yeah. Jedi, Sith, yeah, every, this, everything. The, yeah. This, this uh, wretch from balance. Tatooine. Yeah. Oh, right, right, right. <laughs> That's the Daisy girl, right? That is uh, that, that is, is Daisy. Daisy girl. That's Daisy Ridley. Okay. We will not go into her acting, but yes, that's Daisy Ridley. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. she's cute as button though. Yeah. Oh, she's a cute girl. She's cute, yeah. Um, all right. Well, interesting. They should they should have let her keep her British well, accent. It would probably went better. Oh, bub yeah. bubbly fly here. Uh, put it's in bubby. Jar- bu- it says bubby. Okay. Oh, bubby. Yeah, bubby fly. Bubby fly. Bubby fly has Jar Jar Binks' best line from all the movies. Oh, are you going to read it out loud for the for the class? Go ahead. With it. Lisa with the Okita and the Enduda. <laughs> that was good. Good guy. Derek, you should do a voiceover for Star wow. Wars cartoons. That was Maybe good. I am. You guys just do you don't do that know. in your part time? Awesome. Uh, and all good. the extra time that I have. Yeah. Yes. Your side hustle. <laughs> oh, all right. Um, well. Uh, Bubby, I'm glad that you're tuning in, pal, because uh, we're going to get into some Star Wars trivia. But uh, this isn't just any Star Wars trivia. This is Star Wars trivia. When the uh, if you get the answer wrong, uh, we get jolted with a little force lightning. <laughs> nice. Dun, dun, dun. Nice. Hey, do we guys? Do you guys want to try a, a nice little treat from uh, the destruction of some planets here? 
Oh, that'll be a good idea. We could do that while we get strapped into yeah, our. Yeah, let's do that. Things. So tell us about uh, oh, all the Rand these... cupcakes. Yeah. So, I'm going to go grab a salty. No, you got to eat too. Oh. You know what? Actually, well, go ahead. Let's do this. Maybe we'll take a quick break. We'll refill our drinks. Yeah. And uh, so tell us about these cupcakes. So I made these cupcakes. Um, the. I made them to look like destroyed planets, and I, I think we'll all they're awesome enjoy guys. them. Fantastic job. Um, they're beautiful. Very colorful planets. Yeah. So the surprise is going to be the Pop Rocks on top. <laughs> um, uh, they're Pop Rocks. They are. Jordan I can't eat this stuff, so I made her something special, but uh, yeah. I like that. That's cute, though, Jordy. Tofu cake. <laughs> well, cheers, you guys, for, for destroyed planet cupcakes. Destroyed right. planet cupcakes. Cheers, cheers. All right, here we go. Okay, but- in three, two, one, go. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. You did do it. It's so sour. You mean it with the sour. Oh. Out of my bitch. Oh, Derek. No. No. He's no. not a no. No. He's not a real Jedi. <laughs> Oh, my oh, that tastes God. terrible. It got so much more sour since I made them. Oh, that's so horrible. Oh, <laughs> oh Brad's, Brad's done. Oh. Oh. That's why we needed a break. Well, I'm starting to cry. That's fucking horrible, man. Oh. You're a dick. Yeah, you're a dick. God. Like a double dick. So those... Oh. <laughs> Those of you not in the know, <laughs> I yeah. knew it. Um, His d- voice is cracking. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Our season premiere of this this season, uh, <laughs> we did a ultimate sour challenge <laughs> with um, what is what is that stuff called, Derek? Malic, Malic acid. acid. It's not like the pop rocks I remember. And, yeah. and Derek came <laughs> in here with, the these, pop rocks. with these They've beautiful cupcakes. <laughs> and uh, oh. and I was trying to say, man, maybe we shouldn't eat them on the air, you know, because like, they're cupcakes. He's like, he's like, no, I'd really, and it didn't even cross my mind. <laughs> wow, dude! Really, not even when I was oh. inside, and I was like, I was like, you Jedi put the malic trick. acid in these, didn't you? Jerk's like, no, 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 no. no. Oh, this stuff is but, so sour. How did yours my... taste? I mean, the malic acid was the least of the problems <laughs> with it. <laughs> no, no, I'm mine good. Had no, you gotta try hers. I cannot try it. You have to. Okay, but it's so gross because it's like <laughs> soggy. It tastes like yeah. It's right. like Jedi ass. It's really bad. <laughs> all right. All Just right. try the syrup. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You don't really need the. It, it's Bantapoo. <laughs> <laughs> And just, <laughs> just the flavor is really bad. Like well, that's legit. Just malic acid and three different berries. <laughs> well, berries yeah. are n- are, n- are not necessarily. Well, and now the oh. muffin or the, the the fucking shit is soggy and it tastes like fucking oh. like bantapoo. <laughs> yeah, bantapoo do tastes like sack of shit. Oh my! God. My my true inspiration was uh, the performance by Jar Jar Binks. Oh. Wow. Goodness. Oh, well, thank you for that. That's uh, awful nice of you, <laughs> hey, you're Derek. Okay, do you want to try it? I did. <laughs> you did try that? I tried all of it. All right, guys, we're going to oh, we're gonna take a quick break. We're coming back with Star Wars trivia in just a couple of minutes uh, with a shocking, shocking results. I got to get another drink. God damn it. <laughs> uh, all right, you guys, we'll be right back. We are here. We are strapped in. We are refreshed from our sour oh, we cupcakes. Need- we need the dry erase board, don't we? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh. Steve, have you recovered? Oh, yeah. Well, that's good. All right. So we're going to uh, we're gonna get right into... Uh, <laughs> right. In, oh, thank you. Get right into this uh, little Jedi Force Lightning version of Truth Earth. All right, all right. So uh, we are. We invite anybody uh, tuning in live to play along in the chats and comments, and uh, feel free to answer any questions. You won't get shocked if uh, if you get it wrong, but but we here in the lounge, <laughs> we 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 will not be as uh, fortunate. Yeah. So <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna uh, dive right in. This is Star Wars themed trivia, so uh, quite magical and uh, and mystical. Uh, Jordan will be reading the questions, and uh, Derek, LeBruce, and I will be answering them to the best of our abilities. I like to think that I'm 
not maybe a diehard Star Wars fan, but I'm I'm a, I'm slightly more than casual, I would suppose. Yeah. Um, yeah. So live right. long, live long and prosper, and all that good yes, stuff, and all that good stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> all right, so um, yeah, are we ready? Let's play. Yeah, we're gonna start with an easy one. Oh, great! Or at least you know, I think an easy one because I think I even know this one. Baby Yoda. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Who is Jordan's favorite character? No, I'm just kidding. Um, in Star Wars, what do they call the invisible power that binds the galaxy together? Money. There's no multiple choice. It's Money. Just, you know. Answer. I am I am ready. Wow. Disney magic. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> Lucas Films. <laughs> everybody everybody ready? I think so. The Schwartz. The Schwartz. No. I said the force. Everybody, <laughs> I said love. Every, everybody said the force here. Love. That's correct. That is correct. Yeah. Nice. This oh, one. Is that not how you spell love? I'm sorry. <laughs> it is. This one's a little trickier, folks. Oh, great. <clears throat> C-3PO is fluent in how many languages? Is this the closest without going over? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like a just a guesstimation or a over this many. Well, the closest one doesn't get shocked. The other two get Is it shocked, with right? dialects or just the... I think he mentions it in the films. But I I do not know. I think he mentions it in A New Hope. Oh. Uh, Makes sense. No, Return of the Jedi. All right. What did you guys say? 786. <laughs> wow. 137. I said 1 million. <laughs> million. Well, Brad's closest. Oh, that's <laughs> no way. No. It <laughs> says over 60 million languages. What? Oh. I don't remember that. 60 million languages, huh? Over 60 million. Well, uh, Bubby said five. Yeah. <laughs> You're getting shocked, pal. <laughs> yeah, right. Get over here so we can oh, shock you. Oh, son of a bitch. Here it goes. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Time out. Oh. Time out. Time out. Time out. Oh, my God. It's on 40. What? I was going to say, what level are we starting We're starting on at the... 10. Yeah. Oh. Why? Wow. We started on 10 last week. Well, you weren't here last week. Okay. Three weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, no! We gotta, we gotta start over again. We'll no. go up by five, like you, like you, we did last we time. Sh- we, we, but how many questions do we have? Uh, who knows? There's no Jordan. timeline. Uh, there's a lot. Okay, because so we have to end we above play. forty. Oh my God! I hope not. Oh God, this is terrible. Okay, I'm so is ready. it one, two, three? I, I don't know. We don't. Know. Oh God! I know, I know that. I know that, minus, I know that minus. I know that minus one. Okay. Oh no! Ah! No, just joking. <laughs> I scared the hell out of her. <laughs> She's like, I didn't even press the button. Like, it's malfunctioning. <laughs> Disassemble. <laughs> that was a good movie. Oh my god, it was good. Come on. Oh, oh, Get we're ready. Okay, we're going. Battery's not included. Here we go. Around the room, ring around the room. <laughs> <laughs> Did it work? Brad, no. you're not oh, getting no. shocked. No. What are you worried no. about? Uh, oh, oh, hold on, it, Brad. It's, it's you're, not Brad. Hold on, Brad's not check. getting shocked. Everybody check. It's one of you two. Oh. oh, yeah. Make sure Hold you're on. double beeped. I thought it was single beep. Or I don't single know. Single beep. Single single beep. beep. Jordan doesn't I'm, know what I'm she's talking beep. about. Okay. Okay. Oh. oh. Nothing. No? Okay. Let's try another one. Oh, no. Maybe I'm too. Oh, yeah. No. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> what number is he? What number is he? <laughs> Two. Two? You're three. Oh, you're not working. You're not working. So I press it once, Derek. I did. Okay. Now it's on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then do I do Brad because he was the closest? Of course you always okay. do Brad. No. Why Why would you do that? <laughs> why would you not? My <laughs> hands are so sweaty <laughs> from sitting here gripping okay, the board. We're going. Do it. Oh. Do it. Do it. Do it. It's not working. Oh, my God. God these things I'm are gonna have, awful. Is yours tight enough? <laughs> oh, it's good now. Okay. Do it. Oh. <laughs> God, I hate this game. I love this game. Why do you do this to us? I, I my it. hands are so sweaty. You can my see armpits the, the are water. sweaty. <laughs> Why? That's just it's nasty. stressful being this person too, okay? It's a lot of pressure. All right. That was the second question, guys. <laughs> let's, let's it can do. only go down from here. Let's do this. Darth Vader? Okay, this is a very tricky one. What is the name of Yoda's home? Oh, okay, you're speed writing. Maybe it's not. Wh- what? Oh. Um. 
I can't even give you assistant clues because I have no, no. no I- wait, 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 wait. Like his origin, like no. where he came from, where Luke Skywalker found him. Oh. Yeah, I got where it. Where his house was. I got it. I'm not getting shocked. Yeah, I don't This no. time. I don't know how to spell well, you have it. Well, to spell it right. Yeah, no, 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 no way. <laughs> <laughs> They're made up words. I think I'm ready. All right. What do you guys have? Alderaan. No. <laughs> I said, I said Dagobah. the Dagobah system. Oh, my gosh. Good job, yeah, guys. Yeah, and you spelt it, I think, right. Which one of us? D-A-G-O-B-A-H. Oh, That's me. I left the H off. Oh, nice job. Brad didn't. You're All awesome. right. Awesome. Nerd. Um, <laughs> get over it. I don't know how to say some of these words. Kashyyyk. <laughs> I mean, it's fine to Kashyyyk. switch some questions. <laughs> what is the Toydarian's name who owned Anakin Skywalker? Oh, the Tadarian. Tadarian. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Hold on. Oh, I, I don't, know how, I don't know how to spell it. It's okay. As long as it's phonetic. Oh. Uh, Oh no! Uh, oh, I'm gonna get shocked. Uh, so am I. I'm, I, I'm gonna, and I'm also gonna be mad when <laughs> Steve. Uh, I don't know how to spell it, but I did best I could. <laughs> oh God! I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Um, I don't either. But I'm writing something. I'll say it because so, I know I didn't spell it right. All right, I'm ready. What, what, All right, what do you guys Bruce. got? Watto. It is Watto. Watto. I say he's banta fodder. I said Herschel. Wow. Herschel. Herschel. <laughs> what are these old that men doesn't names? even sound Star Wars. Dude. I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just put a name down. All right, so the Bruce Watto. Is, Bruce misses out on this one. <laughs> oh, he like was, Guano. He was two. Yeah, I was two. Yeah. <laughs> so three and one. Hey, Jordan. Ah. God, We're it. going up by five. Yes. Oh heavens! Well, it's, I'm adjusting. Hold well, on. It, it oh actually it God. actually sucks to get a bunch right and then one wrong. Oh, Ask yeah. Ellie. Yeah, <laughs> her yeah. first shock last week was th- or three weeks ago was thirty. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. I loved it. Okay, so you were two. Okay, <sighs> I'm number three. And here we go. We're off to the races. He points it right at right. <laughs> see a she got see me. a horse. Oh God. <laughs> It's like somebody smacking you in the head. My God. I think we go to the other side. <laughs> I hate this. Okay. Next question. Gonna My put, God. It's going to give one of us a stroke one day. True. It's be done. <laughs> oh, oh, Steve's just, he's just playing. <laughs> <laughs> Steve, has the left side of your face always been that low? <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Bubby said Bob. Bob was the name of Bob. The- Bob. Bob is a great name. That's usually just a good name to go. Bob Smith. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> what is the name of Boba Fett's ship? I'm going to be the only one that gets shocked on this. I am ready. Oh, wait, waiting for Derek to uh, to to close in. Make here. up an answer. To go- make up an answer. Battlestar Galactica. <laughs> um, go very generic. <laughs> Yeah, because this is so generic. <laughs> X-Wing. Okay. Yeah, just push right. number three now. Yeah, just yeah. put it on number three. <laughs> All right. Let it ride. And what do you got? The Centurion. Sla- slave one. What'd you, what'd you put? Yeah, what did you put? <laughs> it's the Centurion. Oh. I just made up a name. <laughs> Leave me alone. It's not a made-up name. Alone. That's like a Roman name. I exactly. Said, I said Battlestar Galactic. I fucked you up, didn't I? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Derek's the only one Twit. getting and it on he here. He is three. I'm no, I'm number one. Uh, no. I'm number one. No, sir. The shoot. Number one in your hearts. Oh. Now, now she's real. She, she doesn't really know now. She's. Oh, like, yeah. No. <laughs> that was a good one. You moved. You moved sides. Did, did, yeah, I did move sides. Did my face move? Because I felt tingling in oh, my yeah. cheek. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, your whole body moved. On yeah. that one. Golly. Th- this can't be medically good. <laughs> no, it, it's not. I wear one of these. We on do a regular not recommend. <laughs> yeah, helps Derek sleep at night. <laughs> All right, let's do. Let's do a couple more. We don't want to hear about your fucked up <laughs> sexual shit, dude. <laughs> How old is Yoda when he dies? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Now, are these in Earth years, or are we doing in yes. Coruscant? Oh, okay. I mean, I guess, yeah. <laughs> I, was that ever said in the film? Yes. Oh, 
I don't know. Return of the um, Shut up, e- nerd. Empire Strikes Back. Yeah. How uh, many minutes in? Anybody? Uh, when such we and all, such we years all good? you reach. Everybody ready? No. Derry, you can't look it up. I'm not looking it up. <laughs> yeah, he is. I'm talking wow. to our guests I'm online. Good. Well, Derek's getting hit. 1,468. 193. I said 300. Oh, Brad, you're closest. Oh, not yeah. that that matters. Wait, yeah, how think, old was he? I think it's like 300. 900. I'm oh, close. Oh, damn, that's right. He was. Oh. He's 600 off. When 900 I'm 400 years, off. You reach. Oh, sorry. And 68. <laughs> Oh, that's all math. Getting, <laughs> I was close. That's right. That's right. He was like, when 900 years you reach. Yeah. Son yeah. of a bitch. Where the hell did he get 193? I don't know. <laughs> the fuck? But that means uh, we're that all. Means you everybody. meant to write 913. <laughs> no, I won that one. Oh, no, no, no. This is right on the money. <laughs> okay, wait. So we're all at 25? Yes. Ooh. Okay, let me adjust them all. This is for you all watching in Grip your YouTube teeth. land. Yeah. <laughs> are, are you going in order? Do we I get to know. know this time? No. Dude, she said 95. <clears throat> yeah. We're going Jeez. for... Why are you looking at me? Don't look at me. <laughs> I don't want to look at anyone. <laughs> <laughs> look at Bruce oh. and then Oh, no, I think, Brad. I think they died again. Whose were you trying? Steve's, I guess. I think I'm on two. That's Steve. Right, hold on. Okay, mine's good. Just get me, do- get me over. Okay. No, don't do oh. Brad's. Okay. Make him oh. wait. Oh, mine was oh. on. Okay, here we go. We're going around. Mm, yeah, oh, okay. God. Oh, okay. Work that time. Oh, oh shit. Mm, it's me. Mm. Ah! Mm. <laughs> Such a heroic yell. Ah! It's, like, ah! it's like the fox mask. <laughs> it's what the Jedi sound like after Order 66. It's Brad's it battle so cry. Good. All right. Yeah. Brad let out a scream like that, and the stormtroopers <laughs> just dropped their guns and walked away. Fuck it. He's. No. <laughs> All right. We'll let him live. Come on. What do we got? What do we got? What is the rule of two? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Oh, I'm still writing. Yeah, sorry, it's kind of long. I just wrote two words, guys. <laughs> what, what do you guys have? I'm not done writing. Oh my God, Derek! Derek's over there writing answers. a writing a, a novel. I always write novels. It's <laughs> uh, Derek, more... Derek's mother chimed in, said, "Closest without going over." It's... Oh crap! Then I lost. Mom, uh, thanks. See, <laughs> what do you got here, she... guys? Can only be two Sith. Sith Lord, Sith Apprentice. I said yes, uh, Apprentice and Master. Yours looks like it says shit. I said student, but... <laughs> oh, I did. <laughs> you wrote shit? <laughs> you wrote Sith Lord shit apprentice. <laughs> Wait, what did you... Did you say the same thing? Yeah, apprentice, apprentice and master. And master. Okay. Same thing. Nice. Okay. Good job, guys. So do we still go up five? No. No. <laughs> we still God, no. God. Say to masochist. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Oh, it's Amidala. Is her the... Yes, Pad- Padme okay. Amidala. Yeah, we, I was close, right? Is that what I said? Yeah, yeah. No. You're right on the money. Okay. Amidama. Oh. Yeah. Same. Alibaba, something yeah. like that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. The forty thieves. The forty Sith. Uh, hmm. Some of these are just too easy. No, no, no such thing. How many planets are in the course? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm looking for some just like obscure things. Um, what age did Padme become a queen? Oh, God. Well, there's this. <laughs> this is the end for me. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm ready, guys. <laughs> uh, should I just shock you? I mean, I would. I think we're all going to be shocked by the answer. Uh, what do you got? 15, 12, and all different <laughs> answers. Uh, the Bruce said 15. Derek said 12. I said 14. I think we're all wrong. The answer is 14. Oh! Oh, he knew it. He knew it. He was hitting the button before you said it. Yeah, but she was actually 15 when she was sworn in. I'm just saying. I mean, <laughs> True. <laughs> oh, man, I get out of this one. Good job, Brad. Okay, I'm going to put them all up to 30. Damn it. We're at 30. I'm this so sorry. This can't be good. No. It's not. It's, it's, We're it's still not. not. Get We're your not. heart ready. I'm ready. I'm not going to react. Mm. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah. Oh, oh God. Did the whole, your got whole shoulder goes glad up. Glad I got out of that one. <laughs> All right, let's do one more. One more. And, uh, one? one. No, we'll come back. We'll do some more later. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll end the show with it. It's fun. Um, I like it. That's silly. Let's see here. Let's see. Do you realize the person picking these is somebody who has nothing <laughs> yeah, I can't, about Star Wars? Even know, that's why it makes it so... She thinks Captain true. Kirk flew the Millennium Falcon. I mean... True. And again, yeah, I can't read some of these words. My goodness, Jordan. Just pick pick a question. It's the last one. What did Han and Luke ride on in the snow uh, while in Hoth? Really? Shut up, Derek. Oh, oh this is this one's tough. I'm not... Not really I'm sure. Not sure. No, I don't even. Uh, I don't know. Um, what did Han and Luke ride on in the snow while in Hoth? I probably got it wrong. No, nah, nah, nah. I think I got it wrong on purpose. I'm kind of enjoying this. You would. Yes, <laughs> it's the Sith in me. Keep getting drunk, and there'll be a Sith in you. <laughs> <laughs> No! <laughs> All right, so who's your father? <laughs> God, I really, really wish sad. I would really wish I could think of the answer, but I don't have it. What do you guys got? Aren't they called tauntauns? Tauntauns. It is a tauntaun. I said a snow horsey. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're getting shocked. <laughs> but a cute, Out of 35. But a cute, creative answer, Brad. <laughs> A, a snow, a horsey. snow <laughs> horsey. You know, I I will say this before we shock him. If he was paying attention to the chat yes, from earlier, we somebody said something about it smelling like the inside of a tauntaun, oh. which is a direct oh. quote from a movie. Yes. Direct quote. All right, give it to me. You're getting a thirty-five. Forty-five. Damn, Jordan, that's fucked up. Wow. Oh God, it's not working. Uh, please, <laughs> dude, it's like Brad's heart stops <laughs> every time. Please, can I hit the button? No, no, no. I just want to hit the button. No, absolutely, you can not. hold it. I just want to hit the button. Nope, just let me no. hit the button. No, I won't. Just no, let me hit the button. Derek, Derek is not Jordan, allowed. One button. Jordan, let him hit the. Oh. <laughs> Go! Oh. <laughs> you gotcha. <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> Derek. Dude, did you push the right button out of all the buttons on that remote control without even looking? Oh, he's been eyeballing it. Dude, the force was with been, you. He has been eye-fucking it. I'm, I'm crying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good <laughs> job. Oh, that's got to <laughs> Sweet misery. <laughs> <laughs> Brad's pains aren't. Oh my god! All right, you guys. <laughs> that was for Bubby Fly. Bubby Fly. That was for you, Bubby. All right. Well, now it is time <laughs> for the only news program in the Empire delivered by the only woman in the galaxy. This Aww. is the Jordy Files. Black Lost. Uh, <laughs> Jordy, Jordy, Jordy. Jordy, Jordy. Jordy. Let the word begin. begin. <laughs> All right, it's the Jordy Files. Here we are. Here we are. What uh, what do we got going on there in the entertainment? world miss jordan well i'm gonna say that all these birthdays are gonna blow your mind today and how old people are yeah they are so. getting, oh, getting she's up going, there oh she's going through the senate yep we are go, <laughs> yeah we, i'm going through everyone in charge here we go um so our oldest birthday people today are from motley crew the guitarist mick mars is 71 today dear My god <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if that doesn't hurt your heart. Wow. Um, also turning 71 today is Jackie Jackson. He is the oldest brother of the Jacksons and, of course, was a member of the Jackson 5. Who? Who? Huh? You know, oh, you know Jackie Jackson. <laughs> yeah, J squared. Um, Who is his brother, though? Uh, LaToya. Yes. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> In today's world, wow. probably. <laughs> oh, probably should have said ja Janet, though. 
Anyway, wow. <laughs> um, country music legend Randy Travis is 63 years old today. He's won numerous music awards, including seven Grammy awards, to be precise. Three wooden he... crosses. <laughs> what? I see what you did there on the side of the road. Oh. There, he won three wooden crosses. Oh, okay. They were on the side of the road. He was inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame in 2016. It took that long. I know, right? <laughs> took that long. Wow. Yeah. Pretty sure it took him having a stroke. Yeah. That too. Naomi missed that it too. by a day. Ooh. I know. Too, too, soon? Soon. too soon. Too soon. Yeah. That. Yeah. Turning 51 years old today is New Radicals frontman Greg Alexander. Most millennials will remember the smash hit, You Get What You Give. Oh, yeah. Ah, I knew that would resonate with you. You are such a millennial. Yeah. <laughs> Green Day bassist Mike Durnt, 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 is 49 Durnt years old. Durnt. Durnt, you dare mispronounce Durnt. that. Oh, no, you dirt not. <laughs> yes, I dirt. Durnt not. Is 40 years old today. <laughs> Fun name. <laughs> um, and the baby birthday, which hurts my whole entire existence, is boy band alumni Lance Bass, who is 43 years old today. Yeah. Happy birthday, everybody. Who thinks that? On the moon, he'd be older. <laughs> I know he's new kids on the block. Uh. <laughs> Ancient. He's a nuclid on the block. <laughs> Ancient. <laughs> so... <clears throat> Some happy news. The post toast Malone is <laughs> expecting his first child with girlfriend and He doesn't has, even look pregnant. I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's early. It's early. Early on. Yeah. And has been quoted saying, I'm the happiest I've ever been. So yes. They what does it say? This is the smallest font I've ever seen in my life. Hold on. That's what he s- said? Yeah. It's like out of context. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't see oh. anything. As, as Post Malone was reading his notes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, yes, he's very excited for the next chapter of his life, and he's the happiest he's been, like I said. Um, and he's only 26, so yay, first child for him. Wow, I thought he was older um, than that. Right? I kind of did, too, until they said that. I heard he that on the radio like, this morning. He yeah, looks he looks pretty like, ancient. <laughs> yeah, he looks like he's pushing 40. He's lived a rough life. You know, it's probably the facial hair. Or the tattoos. The face tats. Yeah. <laughs> um, the postpartum depression. Or the incredible amounts of cocaine and partying. And- True. <laughs> but good for them. And then I guess, you know, his girlfriend is not a uh, celebrity at all. She's just, I guess they've been dating for a really long time and she's just, you know, average. So Okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She's one of the little people. She, yeah. Yes. She's, a li- she's a little thing. <laughs> not, not even little. Just like shoe scum. Yeah. Wow. So. You know, kind of like we the people. I wonder if he's going to have to <laughs> postpone any of his concerts for uh, the. Uh, we're not doing this tonight. Yeah, we're not. We're not going there. <laughs> but I like where your head's at. <laughs> um, Leave me Malone, all right? Oh, 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 oh. Leave me Malone. We're not doing this tonight. He's on fire. <laughs> um, but it, yeah, it also says that um, the girlfriend who hasn't been publicly identified, so she is a secret mystery till that belly pops out. Um, yeah, because there's only one belly that's going to pop out <laughs> in the world. It's post Malone. There's probably well, like twenty of them around together, that's going to pop out. Oh my gosh! True. What if they are walking together and there's like have, three of them with belly? Well, bumps. he could have sympathy pregnancy and like be pregnant with her, so then they could both like. He could buy one of those things. No, nah, he comes off as a real man to me, so I don't think so. Yeah, he's dope. Mm-hmm. Anyway, here we go. <laughs> another dope. another pregnancy. It's the time of birthing yay uh joe jonas's wife sophie turner confirms they're expecting baby number two that is um in sync what the hell is her name sansa 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 from from game Game of thrones Thrones. oh really she does not look like that in game of thrones (laughs) no she's hot yeah got beautiful beautiful blue eyes yeah dude i like i like blue eyes and redheads man yeah she looks a little crazy in this photo I, i can't even see it is Der- Derek's melon in the way? Oh wow, it doesn't even look like her. I know, yeah. man. I don't know. I mean, I thought she usually had like. Well, she was a lot hair. younger yeah. in the uh, Game of Thrones too. Yeah, that's I true. Mean, it was yes. a while ago. So they're expecting baby number two. This isn't even their first. Yeah, so. they've been together a while. Good for them. Yeah. So uh, she is yeah, also their, only twenty six. Ah, and they had their daughter Willa in July of twenty twenty. So um, expecting a new addition. Good for them. 
Yeah. They began dating in 2016 and tied the knot in 2019. And yep. uh, marriages yeah. and babies are good. Yeah. So yeah. what's Willa's fun. middle name? Pill. Am. Willa Pill. Willa Am. Willa <laughs> Am. Sam I Am. Willa Am Jonas. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Moving right along. <laughs> Somebody wow. must stop the madness. <laughs> oh, wow. <clears throat> so Rihanna. Rihanna. No. Rihanna. Rihanna. Yeah, Rihanna. Rihanna appeared at last night's Met Gala as a pregnant marble statue. So another pregnant article. Yay. Um, Dear God. Unfortunately, Rihanna skipped the red carpet on Monday night's Met Gala, robbing us all of the opportunity to see what kind of fabulous maternity fashion she would have come up with. However, she was still there in spirit in the form of a statue. What the hell is a Met Gala? Is that like like for the Mets or something? <laughs> oh my god. You uncultured swine. I was going to say that. Brad. It's a fundraiser it's a fundraiser it's for a fundraiser, rich people. Fundraiser, say. <laughs> it's a fundraiser for rich people. Oh. <laughs> uh, um So, yeah, her and her boyfriend ASAP Rocky are expecting their first child. <laughs> His name is ASAP Rocky. Wow, Jesus. I don't know. Uh, is he a rapper? Ew, <laughs> no. <laughs> what would give you that idea? I don't know. Just and a I wild feel like guess. She's ready to pop any day. It doesn't say when, but yeah. So that would have been kind of entertaining to see her as a little pregnant pregnant statue. No, not at all. Yeah. <laughs> so yay for her. All right. Um, <laughs> Jesus. Can Control. we go to the next article? Oh. Control the excitement. I'm trying to just like, you know. You're just taking in the moment, huh? Yeah. On, on on the air? Yeah. yeah sure. You, you this is my that. moment, okay? This is yeah. my time to shine. Dead air. <laughs> Dua Lipa announces she's quit smoking. I oh, did it for her. And I have stuck to it, she what, says. What, what's it? So. I, I got to ask, what is a Dua Lipa? Seriously. <laughs> seriously. I have no clue what a Dua Lipa is. I is feel it, like he asked this last time uh, we talked Dua about Lipa Dua Lipa. Dua Lipa is a person. I thought it was a parkour move. Dua Lipa. It sounds like something you is that caught. a Star Wars reference? Parkour? <laughs> a parkour. Is that so, like hardcore? No. <laughs> well, yes. It's, it's, hardcore walking. It sounds like something uh, the doctor gives you that's bad news. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's Dua Lipa. Hi, man. You gotta do a leap over there oh and then God. and then fall down over here <laughs> just do a leap of there <laughs> sounds like bill so she's embracing a healthier lifestyle and recently <laughs> revealed she's finally quit smoking so um, but just cigarettes <laughs> yeah because yes. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. she's still smoking in this picture so she <laughs> said that quitting smoking is one way she stayed on top of her mental health and that it energizes her to keep up the good work. And to help so. get me over it, I smoke twice as much weed now. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah. You know, you got to... The yeah. healthy smoke. <laughs> the healthy smoke, obviously. <laughs> Maybe she takes edibles now. Oh, I'm pretty sure they're edible, but I don't think they're what you think. <laughs> she is also working on her third studio album, so... Mm. Yay. Mm. We love Dua Lipa. Yeah. yeah. She stopped uh, smoking and uh, she's working Dua on her Lipa. album. It's going to come out like an Atlantis More Set album. <laughs> Angry as hell. True. All <laughs> about smoking. Yeah. All about cigarette innuendos. <laughs> I hate the world. <laughs> um, this one, guys, is awesome. I heard this today on the radio so as the well. Rest of and then I creeped awesome? the list. Actually, no, not on the radio. I actually got an email and then I creeped <gasps> the list. So it, there is How to See Imagine Dragon. Uh, Halsey, Sean Mendez, and a bunch more for just $25. So times are tough. So here's some good news. Concert um, promoter Live Nation is bringing back its $25 ticket promotion for this summer. I repeat, $25 for this summer. I mean, you'll be in the parking lot a mile away, but they'll have a 65-inch television for you to enjoy the concert. <laughs> yeah, you'll be in the nosebleeds with no chairs. Oh, but... You're being generous with the yeah, size. Yeah, nosebleed. <laughs> Starting May 4th, which is today, through May 10th, you can buy tickets for tons of top acts for just 25 bucks each. And the list is super long, and clearly Brad's made it clear we don't have enough airtime. So go <laughs> look at the list. And, it is, it is a really, um, it's a super cool promotion to first, be able to go. Yeah. I first come, first serve. We have four tickets. Yeah. <laughs> yeah maybe. Chop, chop. 
There, yeah, you go to check out for any of them. It's yeah. like sold out, sold yeah. out, sold yeah. out. Sorry sold for out. all of you that are listening to this live. They're already sold out. Yeah. No, if you can get <laughs> the tw- dun, dun. yeah, you can get a twenty five dollar ticket, but don't go with anybody because you're not going to be sitting near them. Oh, I'm sure it's all general admission <laughs> for the vlogs. Oh my gosh, <laughs> you're not going to be sitting. <laughs> New Kids on the Block is on the list. It says even select dates for the Jonas Brothers Las Vegas residency. Man, your favorite bands. <laughs> Over three thousand seven hundred shows Whoa. in all are part of the promotion. Wait a second. Wait a minute. Yeah. Las Vegas is now Jonas Brothers. Wait a yeah. second. God. You just <laughs> said new kids are on the block as well. The Jonas Brothers. Well, it was really just the new kids on the block. Don't, but then I just mm-hmm. went into. You, you can't just slide over the new kids to get to Jonas. Wow. I was just reading the sentence. That's really disrespectful. <laughs> oh, wow. sorry. So, somebody's having a moment. Yeah. Wow. Really disrespectful. <laughs> Derek is salty tonight. I know. God. Oh my dude. God. He soured poisoned us. <laughs> sour. <clears throat> Some and, of the and... sour plus. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know if you're being like sarcastic. Do you really like New Kids on the Block? No. Oh, okay. I'm, no. Like, I'm, like, I'm starting to think. I'm like, like oh, damn. We, we talked at a heartstring here. Um, <laughs> the best New Kids on the Block song is about an Oreo cookie, and it was sung by Weird Al Yankovic. <laughs> wow. Weird Al. Speaking about Weird Al, you know what? He, <laughs> you, you know a video I just saw recently. What's that? Uh, what's this one with uh, Amish Life? Or the- oh, oh yes. yeah, Amish Paradise. Yeah, Amish Paradise. Yeah, that's that a good shit one. Shit was great. So funny. I forgot who he was. I'm just skimming through YouTube, and I'm like, Weird. I said, "Oh man!" And then it all came back. It all just of it. all came flooding back. Yep. Yeah, that's a great tune. Yeah, eat, that is it, a good eat it. Eat <laughs> it. Well, we certainly <laughs> can't. Uh, we can't. Uh, I I didn't get an image for this. I'm not sure why, but um, you know, obviously we wow. uh, 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 Naomi Judd passed away over the weekend, yeah. um, yeah. A, a day shy of her being inducted into the uh, Country Music Hall of Fame. And um, don't read about it because the more you read about it, the sadder it is. Oh uh, well, so, like, well, they yeah. keep saying it's because of mental health. So yeah, everybody and then can just put yeah. two and two well, together. and then there was just a lot of layers to it. Like just that whole family is just like a yeah. There's a lot going on there. there. It's, yeah, oh yeah, it's not but good. Country music legend. And uh, and certainly gone before. Did you time. also yeah. just see that that girl? I think it either happened. Yes, I think it was yesterday. From she is like a meme kind of thing. Like she was a photo. Like if you've ever seen that little girl, the photo that's like kind of uh, thing or uh-huh. something. She was on Toddlers and Tierra, I guess, or something. She's sixteen. She also just passed away. I guess oh, wow. she committed suicide as well. Crazy um, man. That, that was weird with Naomi because she was like yeah. seventy one years old. Seventy six. Okay. Yeah. I know she it's was like, like you made it yeah. that far in life and then you were just like And they were gearing yeah, up uh so sad. They were gearing up to go back out on tour yeah. as the Judds. Like that that was they, they had dates. It was it was ready yeah. to ready I, to go. I just would like to see how she pulled it off. But she had a lot of problems with the throat and the cancer and all that in her throat and then didn't she? Did she yeah. have like throat I'm, serious throat I, issues I don't and know. stuff? Yeah, I don't I, know. Yeah. I think I that's why know. they originally stopped. Yeah, terrible. But yeah, um, so didn't want to didn't want to end it on that such yeah. a sad note. But um, thanks, Jordan. S- yeah, so lots of well, I guess the Empire won. Sad things. Yep. <laughs> but back to the concert tickets. If you want to end on a happier note before we conclude, I there is a new hope. You could still see you them. You could in still concert. see the concerts. Um, wow. Maybe not the Judds, but um, <laughs> Return of the Judds. Backstreet Juds? Boys was one of the ones on the list. Oh. Excellent. I really want I heard to they were back. All right. All right. Uh, Except for they can't do their splits and moves because they're old as hell now and busted, but well, it's that's, okay. That's okay. Well, we can forgive them. It's probably them better for not aging. to have them do the uh, splits and stuff and acrobatics anyway. Isn't that like Mark Wahlberg? Was no. He, was he? Oh, who was he? Oh, with? he's the new kids. He, oh. Yeah. Uh, Mark Wahlberg was not back. the new kids. Who the his hell brother. Was? Oh, his brother was. His oh. brother, Donnie. Yeah. Oh, that's right. He was Marky Mark. That's right. Yeah. yeah. That's right. Funky Bunch. He had a funky bunch. Yeah. Oh. Okay. And anyway, so now that's that's the end of the Jordy Files. <laughs> Yay! I had on a happy night. I should have had a V8. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh my god! Did you just call him Ugly One or Obi Wan? <laughs> ugly One Kenobi. <laughs> and it is time for another raucous round of Name That Tune. Yeah, making words up tonight. Just like everybody else. All right, you guys. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. It is time for Name That Tune. And uh, we invite all of our live viewers to play along with us in the chats and comments. We are looking for the song name and the artist or band that's performing it. Tonight's category is Star Wars References. So songs that reference 
Star Wars in some way in the lyrics. This is not going to be easy. Uh, so maybe we should have done a shock game for this. But I did sprinkle in some uh, some songs that are uh, a little more popular, I suppose. Anyway. Yeah, for who? <laughs> for me. <laughs> Let's play. You guys ready for the first clue? No. Here it is. It's coming right at you. And now they're off not far away. It's kind of on occasion. I know this one. Really? That was in the movie? Here it is one more time. Wasn't that the name? And now they're off not far away. It's kind of on occasion. Elderon. Elderon's not far away. That's the lyrics. Uh, so you see what we did there? Yes. It was a bit of a Okay, we st- I stand a chance then. You might stand a chance from this this particular one. I, I don't know how to spell any of it, and I probably got it all wrong. That's okay. What do you guys got? Red Hot Cal- Chili Peppers, California, California and Nirvana. <laughs> Everybody got Californication. Steve, you you tried. Yeah, I'm proud of you. Half Everybody point. got Californication because it was in the damn song. <laughs> Usually you don't play that. I know. I figured I'd make it a little easier on you guys. Yeah, he uh, still failed. He played Electric Avenue. Because I, yeah. I find oh. it. Uh, yeah, I still failed. I find uh, that this one's probably not going to be so uh, so easy. Here we are. Next clue. Star Wars fur, yeah, I'm rocking you. The one chief rockin- oh yeah, that guy. Here it is one more time. Star Wars fur, yeah, I'm rockin' you. Baka the one chief rockin'. The uh, Don chiming in from the last answer. It is the Chili Peppers Californication. Nice job, Don. Over there on uh Facebook. What do you guys got here? Chewy by an ex king member. That's not right. Star Wars tribute, Waka Flocka. No. Uh, I am God, not right. But Kanye West is right. Uh, it uh, is. I know that. Kanye oh no, voice. no, no! I was right. He he's an ex king member. <laughs> no, he wasn't. He was a good. He was a good Christian boy. This is guilt trip. Yeah. Yeah. Star Wars fur, yeah, I'm rocking you. Baka the but one. Was this chief really rocking. Kanye or was this yay? No, this is Kanye. Uh, this song's quite old. Uh, Who's this? Yay. <laughs> he goes by Yay now. Oh, I didn't Dropped even know the that. Con, oh. and he's just Yay. Oh no, he's still got the Con. Jeez. But he only Megan over the on uh, YouTube next? got uh, Californication by the Peppers. We what's, must have a little bit of a delay. What's next? Is he going to be a symbol like Prince? Uh, yeah, you never know. He's already been there. He already is a symbol in his own mind. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the next clue, you guys. I need to stop. There's a I saw Star Wars and Lee State Times had the Pac-Man at Here it is one more time. I saw Star Wars and Lee State Times had the Pac-Man at Oh my gosh. It was quite fun going through all these tunes and trying to figure out where the references laid. Um, I did you, you know, want to hear it one more time? I'm drawing such a blank, and I know it's country music. Wait, this is a country song. Yeah. Can you tell that? Yeah. Oh yeah. There's... I had no idea. Mm-hmm. What do you guys got here in the lab? I, just, I got nothing. I just drew a big fucking blank. Uh... No clue. Alan Jackson, not correct. Alan Jack. Okay, is it the same person who sings that? There's um, gone no. for good, I and there's good and Alan gone, Jackman. and it's. Thank you. For the rest of your dog gone? No. Okay. Uh, I do not know. know. What What do you have, Jordan? I had nothing. I'm trying to think of who sings that. Uh, You guys got to make something up. Come on. Okay, hold on. (laughs) She can't (laughs) Google it. No, wait. Chris Cagle. It is not Chris (gasps) Cagle. No. Damn it. No. No, it's older than that. Um, This is 19 something by Mark Wills. Wills. Never heard of it. Damn. I used to sing it in karaoke ages and ages. That's a great song. I should have got it too. Goes to the ages. It's fun. Um, All right. Uh, Next clue coming right at you. Here we go. It's telling me that you're a stalker. Like God made a chase of Skywalker. I told y'all with the street talker. It ain't my fault you. Here's, here's that part one more time. It's telling me that you was a stalker. Like God made a chase of Skywalker. I told y'all with the street talker. It ain't my fault you. He, he rhymed Skywalker with Street Talker. He also said he also said uh, Darth Vader in there. I know. Uh, w- is it surprising that that a lot of the Star Wars references come from rap songs? Yes. And hip hop. It's not surprising to me. I feel like there's a lot to say. They have funny words too to rhyme with. I do. There were some other good ones too, but 
I wanted to mix it up a little bit. Any any guesses? Oh yeah, I got it. <laughs> Steve's got it. Huh? <laughs> All right, what do you guys got here? Sucks by ex drug dealer. <laughs> um, Don um. said, "What the fuck." <laughs> That's a better uh, one. Skywalker Walker. No, no. Okay, I can't remember his name. That is not, not Andre 3000, but the other guy. A uh, big boy. It's not oh. Outcast. Wait a minute. Not Andre 3000. What's so on? this was kind of a trick because the song is actually by Missy Elliott and it's called All In My Grill. Um, but that was the feature uh, rapper on that particular track. <laughs> That's <laughs> rude, Brad. Oh, dear God. Well, I didn't realize it was him singing the words. Anyway, I thought it was supposed to be music. Uh, oh. RTD2 he agrees. No, he absolutely RTD2 agrees. RTD2 just <laughs> he absolutely tore agreed. into everybody. <laughs> All right, you guys. One more clue. Thank God. <laughs> Here it is. Here it is one more time. Is oh, my God. in the last 20 Kim, years? Well, that's, mo- I will say, uh, that's modern uh, country. Kimberly on YouTube chimed in with All in My Grill. You got it. Well, Good for job, the last, Kimberly. last clue. Nice job. Uh, here's the here's the current clue. It's it's tougher now that I'm not uh, editing them and I'm listening to them really for the first time. Uh, but yeah, any any guesses at all? Hold on. Uh, Steve, of course, has a guess. <laughs> We apologize for the delay. Uh, there's a de- the delay in the live, but uh, thank you guys for playing. Awesome. All right, what do you, what do you, what do you got here? Rap Country by Cookie Cutter Cowboy. That's uh, not right. Uh, Stormtrooper by You Suck. <laughs> uh, not correct. Uh, it, Absolutely Keith not. Keith Urban, no. Uh, this is Wonderful by Everclear. The things that I had before, like a Star Wars I don't even know who they are. Door. How is Ever Everclear? Never mind. Never mind. I thought that was a drink. Is So did I. I it was like moonshine, man. I don't want to tell you. They suck live, though. They're the worst band I've ever seen live in my life. They sucked on that recording you just played. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. It's like a nickel. All right. Good job. You guys got it's like some. It's like we got music. one. <laughs> And it's the Kim again, wonderful by Everclear. She's killing it over there on uh No on. Googling. Kim. She's got Google. <laughs> Maybe. Or she has the force. Or the Shazam. Or the force. Could be the force. You never know. You never know. <laughs> All right, you guys. We're going to uh I don't know where Jordan just went. And I see your Schwartz is as big as mine. <laughs> Jordan just took off. I have a game that I put together, a special game. Um, and it's paying homage to how terrible stormtroopers are at firing their blasters right <laughs> it's bad it's bad so we're gonna play only imperial stormtroopers are so precise <laughs> we're yeah. gonna <laughs> we're gonna play a little game uh that i like to call stormtrooper blast off <laughs> that was great wow very good <laughs> Very good, Trooper. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't think any of you, especially you, would actually hit a target today, so I'm impressed. Well done. <laughs> All right. All right. So here's what we're going to do. I, uh, I have... These incredibly authentic Imperial blasters. <gasps> You'll let us use them? And then I got, uh, I stole them from the Death Star. Uh, Before or after it was destroyed? After, obviously. Yeah. I'm thinking after, <laughs> kind of like in the debris field. So what we're going to do, I kind of showed it before, but I'll, I'll, uh, I'll show it again. So we have, uh, we have these heroes over there on the shelf that we're going to be firing at. And uh, Jordan, who's the third one? that yeah oh um she knows yeah she knows jala yeah no. yes 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 jala, yes, jala. No, but it, it wasn't it played by um commonly known by ahsoka but Zoe, yes no 
No, no, <laughs> or, uh, absolutely. What's the other one? No, that horrible thing that showed up in in the Mandalorian. No. No. Okay. Anyway. Anyway. No. Good talk. <clears throat> no, they should have used the girl that actually did Ahsoka in the animated series. Oh, Ahsoka. That it was actually modeled after. I don't know. And she's actually a really good actress. Yeah, we're <laughs> regardless, we're oh. about to shoot her up right here. Or miss. Wow. So uh Wow, those look like ladies inf- first. Those look like Imperial inflation blasters. It. Yes. They're they're uh they're gonna they're gonna blast away. Anybody He's want pointing in it in my direction? <laughs> I, I don't like it. Anybody catch w- it right in the eye. Jordan wants to go first. Ladies right. first, yeah. So Jordy's gonna go first. I'm gonna move the camera. Around How many shots? So that we could see. Um, so we're gonna give you two blasters. So you have two opportunities to uh, to blast them. Blast them. I'll blast them at the same time. Blast them. All right. Well then, come come over here. Oh dear. And, uh, so we're gonna just make the desk the line. So you'll stand right. Wow, right that's at the, pretty far. Right at the end of the desk. I can't even see that far. Yes. Yeah, I did some testing. Testing of the uh, of this here. All right. So Jordan, I dare you to shoot Brad. Please don't do that. Uh, just that the you could <laughs> right in the, the forehead. Just so you're in the shot there. Um. All right. So yeah. Uh, what, what hero are you gonna try to hit over there, Jordan? Derek's favorite, Han Solar. All right, so she's gonna try to hit Han Solar uh, over there you. on the shelf. How dare you! So, all right, take aim, Jordy. Ham salad. Oh, you missed. Uh, yeah, you're a stormtrooper. Yeah, you are a stormtrooper, no doubt. Oh, uh, you got yes. him! So bad. Got me right in the heart. Nice, Jordy. I mean, it's almost like his son rammed a lightsaber through him or something. <laughs> All right. So uh, while they get that reloaded, who wants to go next? <laughs> oh, out, of, out of the gentleman here. Oh. All right. The Bruce, he's going to use his Sith magic, Jedi magic. Are you playing this, Brad? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to play this one. So there we go. All, all loaded up. <laughs> so, oh, my God, please. At least I have glasses on. My God. <laughs> my those, God. Those back things, it up they, there, sir. Yeah, you got to go back. All right, God. Steve the Bruce. Who are you aiming for first? Oh, uh, whichever one it hits. Perfect. That sounds like a true stormtrooper. He's a cop. Oh, got Ahsoka. And all right, you got one. All right, D Master. Talking mad shit about Ahsoka. No wonder we're down. All right, Derek is uh, coming up here. Feeling hot, hot, him. hot. Gonna get him loaded up here with blaster bullets. Blaster bullets. <laughs> That's what they call them. Blaster blaster cells. I don't know. Are you gonna go too, Brad? I will go. Ooh. I will go. This is fun. Whoa. My eye. All right, there you go, Derek. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. I think there was already one on there. Are you doubling it up on purpose? <laughs> okay. Stormtrooper yes, shotgun. Oh, All Derek's right. doing a double band. Now, Derek, who are you aiming for? <laughs> You're aiming for Jordan. <laughs> that was easy. All right. There we go. Derek is firing the first shot there. Oh, yeah, right on target. Nice. Yeah, it goes high. It, it did not. Did Stay it. on target. Stay on target. Yeah, I guess oh, Use the force. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Oh, Derek. <laughs> Pull up red two. All right. Uh, I guess it's my turn, huh? All right. So I'm going to. Wow. You heard the applause. It was awesome. <laughs> that was, that's like, just, I guess. That was a studio audience. We didn't pay them this month. Yeah. <laughs> they all went home. Or any month. Yeah. Studio audience. She hasn't arrived yet. <laughs> yeah. That's fair. <laughs> Ow. That's not nice. I, I you got one. You got a target. That's just because Jordan's not the hero. Got the princess target. All right, here we go. Let me. Uh, here we are. I'm gonna use my Jedi mind trick on the bullets here. Oh. Yep, worked forgot, well. I, forgot I was plugged in there. Oh. <laughs> Jedi mind trick worked really well. <laughs> Brad's got a magnet. Gotta, gotta have a mind <laughs> oh. first, I imagine. <laughs> Opie dopey Kenobi. <laughs> All right, here we go. And here he goes, folks. Who are you aiming for, Brad? He said Luke Skywalker. Brad is going for Luke the Skywalker. The only one who has not been hit. 
Oh, he he's hit a Jedi. Han in the he nuts, Han. though. He nicked him. Oh, oh got Luke. Got yeah, somebody was practicing all day. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? If Brad had yeah. a real job, he would have hit like that today. Yeah, right. <laughs> he did have a real oh. job. He was at his job today. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you all talking wow. shit in there? No, no, no. He, he woke up and walked to the lounge. Yeah. Hadn't played with the guns all day. Yeah. Uh, After he stole them from the Battlestar Galactica Enterprise yes. experience. Yes. Yes. That. Yes. Right there. Yes, D- D- Jordan. My God, I can't believe how knowledgeable you yes. are of science fiction. The Delta films. Airplane. Yes, may the force be long and prosper. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, that um, sounds good. The Wrath of Genghis Khan. So I'm going to say that I won because I... I you hit two, kind of? I kinda? hit two. Yes, or I like injured, one in one quarter? I injured Han Solo. No, in Stormtrooper, you failed. Jordan yeah. actually won. True. Huh? Do we get to have a lifesaver fight now? A lifesaver fight? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe on the break. We'll, oh, dear God. Lifesaver. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Life, lifesaver fight, Steve. <laughs> um, well, <laughs> I think we're going to... Uh, so at special. least you didn't say laser sword. <laughs> I think we're going to actually uh, dive into... Version. Freaking laser beams. <laughs> freaking laser beams. <laughs> Catch to their freaking head. Well, since Ellie is not here... And I really wanted her to be here. I know she's, she's got like, like a she's got an actual Star Wars tattoo. She's a huge Star uh, Wars fan. She loves it. So, um, Christ, uh, she had a Millennium Falcon <laughs> cake. Yeah, that's for, yeah, that's mm-hmm. true. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna dive into. Uh, I'll be taking the reins for midweek motivation this week. Um, so uh, wait a minute, whoa, 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 you're gonna motivate us? I'm gonna motivate you. Oh, dear God, get ready for Dude, it. Here we go. <laughs> All right, this is Midweek Motivation. Now, you guys, the Star Wars universe is loaded with wonderful lessons and motivating quotes. None more memorable than the original galactic guru, Yoda. So here are six motivational quotes from our favorite little green friend. Mm, don't shit in your porridge. <laughs> <laughs> so here we go, Jordan. This is when uh, that comes into Ooh. play. Here we are. So uh, the first quote. Do or do not. There is no try. Yes. <laughs> right. Okay. So you guys. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> Thank you. I have five more. Uh, <laughs> Did you God. stay this height so you could do this 20 years? <laughs> Maybe, perhaps so. <laughs> this is a simple lesson uh, in commitment and the power in giving something 100%, not just dipping your toes. Do or do not, there is no try. Number two. Just put the tip in. <laughs> <laughs> you must unlearn what you have learned. We are habitual creatures. We love routine and our go-to methods. Sometimes, however, we must shake up our process and even unlearn our process to succeed. Damn, that was deep. Number three. Named must be your fear before banished you can. When we call out our fears directly, they become less of this ominous force uh, and in turn become just a challenge to tackle Head on. Named must your fear before banish you can. Before banish it you can. I should have put some punctuation in there, I think. No, nah, Yoda didn't use punctuation. <laughs> Number four. That is why you fail. When Luke admits that he doesn't believe in the power of the force, Yoda slaps him with this nugget of wisdom. Believe in ourselves and our abilities is the way to success. Without that faith... We can only get so far. Number five. The greatest teacher failure is. God, I simply, can't. we should learn from our mistakes. Our young people could learn that. Mm-hmm. And finally, number six. Pass on what you have learned. Sleep. Sleep. That's when he was dying. Anyway, the uh, wisdom we learn, the wisdom that we earn in life is a gift to pass on. So be sure to share your experience and stories with anybody uh, who is willing to listen. Brad Brock, I am. And this has been 
your midweek motivation. <laughs> Good job. Thank you so much. Thank you. That was cool. It hit differently this week. Wow. Differently it hit. Differently it hit. Yeah. We, we, yeah. we, we, we don't want to hear about y'all's personal life. Okay. We're, we're, we're good. Uh, oh, Brad, be Yoda. All right. Let's uh-huh. do the voice. Do the voice. Right now, half the people watching just puked in their own mouths. <laughs> let's jump into our shameless plugs. All right. Of course, you guys, uh, I'm going to go around the room. Uh, I know that Derek mentioned that he's got some shameless plugs to uh to go through so why don't we start with you derek well let me get my uh get off the phone let me get my swords out of my back swords better we we have already life, established my life saving swords lifesavers better than a knife in your back so we always talk about supporting local here and um i met a couple of brothers today it was actually um just a couple hours before coming here that uh, had a grand opening to a brand new barber shop with a new concept out in St. Lucie West. Name of the place is called Head Games. So if you want to bring your kids while you're getting your hair cut, while you're sitting in the chair getting your nails done, your 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 feet done, whatever, they've got a video game room for your kids to sit and enjoy themselves. That's actually cool. So Head Games in St. Lucie West. Here's their business card. That's oh, nice. Really, that's really cool. Neat um, idea. We'll put a we'll, we'll put a we'll put their website yeah. uh, in the links. Just yeah, they, that card with me. Uh, great couple of guys. Um, real personable. Um, like I said, they just opened uh, in St. Louis West on Saturday, and um, yeah, hoping for good things for them. They got a great concept, and they the whole family dynamic is really really special to them. That's cool. Um, they are actually brothers who grew up in. Port St. Lucie. We're born in Port St. Lucie. Um, so, Rare. Good. Local. Yeah. L- really local. That's awesome. So uh, definitely want to support them. Prices are, are comparable to anybody anywhere else you go. The video games are free. Even if you want to stay after your getting your hair cut, if you don't have any kids or anything like that, you can play play games as well. So That's pretty cool. That's yeah. awesome. That is actually cool. <laughs> when I walked in, they were actually playing um, the Nintendo 64 version of Mario Kart, and I was That's like, awesome. this is amazing. That's nice. awesome. Throwback games, yes. too. That's cool. Yeah. Fun idea. So, Yeah, head games. Check them out. We will check them out. Awesome. Any, uh, any shameless plugs, the Bruce? Well, there was this one time with Princess Leia and Han Solo. There were, there were some drinks involved, and Oh, oh, shameless. Oh, not shameless moments. Yes, shameless oh, plugs. Oh, no, no, no shameless plugs. I'm, I'm good. Thanks. Okay. Shit. Thanks. <laughs> shameless plugs from the Jordy? Um, well, since you so kindly asked, um, as some of you know or don't know, started a new job recently. I guess I've been there a month now today. And we have some topical hair products and we also have some supplements and whatnot to help you age later or live younger longer too too late too late for me Um, is that why your hair looks so full and and Uh, shiny it is i mean look at what they've done for brad (laughs) yes he takes them more than anyone so um, you're not doing you're not helping (laughs) yeah yeah. (laughs) needs to take them (laughs) needs to take them that's the before picture (laughs) um (laughs) yeah so if you have any you know needs for any kind of supplements or hair type of things come see me talk to me i get a i can get you get you a good hookup and um yeah do so it's yeah that's what cool. they need for the commercial do like it like a before and after then you have you like the before and then have some like 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 chris hemsworth oh like God. after oh or what if we did a before and after but brad's before picture was now and we did his after of him when well, he was like when, 17 17 yeah, yeah that would be like, yeah. five wow five, five years old <laughs> yeah, the last time he had a full head of hair five yeah. damn five. damn uh, yeah so check them out They're the fourth the force is not strong with me <laughs> no no so check maybe that's what's pushing the follicles out hey just oh. j- just go bald Dude, I mean, no, it'll never ever no, I'm back any the, of it. I am liking the mohawk. You're, you're like the reverse. The of, mohawk. You're like the reverse of Big Dave. He's it's got not, a mohawk right now. It's not an intentional mohawk. Yeah, it's like a faux hawk of some sort. He's got one going. Just shave. No, just, just do it. Shave. Just do no. it, dude. I won't. Carry on. But Jordan. anyway, they're called Hush and Hush, <laughs> and they're also local. So, um, yeah. So 
Can we come talk to me? Talk. Nice. Keep it yeah. down. Thanks. Now. That's it. Hush and hush. Yeah. You know, hush hush. You know what, Derek? It's a secret. The secret is science. Every time I, she says hush and hush, I think of that song by Me Till too. Tuesday. So do I. Yeah. Wait, I is it the hush, hush, cry, cry? No. No, no, no. no. Okay. It's that what song was it? Keep it down now. Go ahead, sing it, man. Voices, voices carry. Yeah. That was, uh, oh. yeah, voices carry. Okay, yeah, yeah. Hush, keep it down now. Mm-hmm. Not going to lie. I might even have like a, I think I recorded a cover version of that somewhere. <gasps> oh, like, my goodness. Produced, like studio produced. It's, it's. Gotta be around somewhere. Wow. Anyway, wow, that is sh- a shameless plug right there, folks. Shameful plug. Shame, uh, yeah. My shameless plugs. Uh, of course, I'd like to thank all of you for uh, tuning in live and hanging out with us this evening. Always a blast. <laughs> pew pew. <laughs> with pew, all pew. of you. Pew 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 pew. Um, please like, share, follow, and subscribe to our show. Uh, I know our YouTube channel could use a little bit of love, so please go and subscribe to us there. Um, a big plug announcement, to be honest with you, uh, is that we're going to be out of town next week. Uh, so we'll be presenting our very first best of episode for all of you to enjoy. So uh, that'll be my my uh, project on Friday is pulling uh, pulling together that show. But it should be pretty, pretty good. I'm excited about it. Um, so please uh, tune into that next week. We'll be still like watching and, and chatting uh, with you guys on the comments. But uh, we will be out of town that particular uh next next week so where are you going we're taking a break going up to the big d <laughs> double d's d d town going, going, going to d we're gonna be rolling in the d rolling in the d it's hey, only hey, miles hey, away. hey nobody admits to going to detroit <laughs> okay just we're going to michigan yeah yeah to, sounds to better mitten. sounds better go to wayne county yeah people are thinking oh great. oakland county oh great oh, they're gonna they're gonna go to the they're gonna go to the lake they're gonna the real the lake house mm. yeah. yeah we kind of are though yeah uh we are we're saying i'm a a, a lake yeah, yeah which one yeah we get we get uh, right out of the city uh, it's the one silver at, lake cast lake i don't know one of those it's the one at 15th and 12th the fire go, hydrant broke go check out gun lake <laughs> It, oh, fl- it flooded an apartment complex. Oh, my God. Anyway, I'm never going to get through this show. Oh, you started the detox. I did. Oh, yeah. Uh, shout out to our sponsors and partners uh, at Code Rum, um, TCNightlife.com, uh, Todd and Laura. Uh, they made an announcement and actually reached out to me today. Uh, I talked to Todd a little bit. Um, they, they, are, they are relinquishing TCNightlife.com. Um, because they're focused, you know, of course, uh, as we had mentioned many, many moons ago that they, they had moved up, uh, to the mountains and, uh, Good in order them. to focus on their, their new adventures up there, it's, it's becoming increasingly more difficult, uh, for them to keep up with the, you know, ever changing entertainment landscape here. So they're not able to keep that calendar up to date. Um, so he did reach out to me and ask me for one more shameless plug. And I, it's my absolute pleasure. Um, TC will still have uh everything it's still up and everything that'll be scheduled or that is currently scheduled be will be there for you to check out um uh, until obviously the calendar runs out um uh there is talks of somebody picking up the torch and and doing it in their own way but um i don't have any details on that at the moment um but uh todd and laura we love you thank you so much for all of your support for all the years um, not just here for the podcast, but uh, musically uh, coming out to see my shows, uh, supporting all of our local talent, helping getting things booked, um, all the work that you did for several venues around the area. Um, and, you know, like, this isn't a sad thing. I'm so stoked that you guys are on a new adventure and doing your thing. Um, we're just uh, sad that you're that you're not here. Yes. Um, but we're so happy for uh, for this and uh and all the, uh, the the support that you've given us over the years and this isn't the end we're coming to see you so uh save save us a save us a, a room <laughs> at your house but we love you guys so uh go and check out tcnightlife.com uh and and see what's there uh in the in the near future and uh and, and we'll keep you in touch with everybody about uh what the next big entertainment calendar is that comes up so uh there's that uh of course uh big thanks to the sneaky tiki for always being uh uh just huge supporters of what we do hop life brewing treasure coast entertainment snorkel corn entertainment paul at the drums and rums uh, bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. 
uh, Ben and Hector at 561 Music. Please support our friends who support us and support local whenever you can. Uh, only one chance to see me this week before we head out of town, and that's tomorrow night at Manatee Island in Fort Pierce from 530 to 830. It is Cinco de Mayo. I'm not sure what their specials are, but uh, there may be tacos and there will likely be tequila. tequila. So <laughs> we're going to be doing and that. And Corona. And Corona. And tequila in Corona. Mm-hmm. So and Unless uh, you're Duffy's, then it's Bacardi. Yeah, that, that, that too. Oh. Oh, all right. I mean, you know, whatever. D- different strokes for different folks. Mm-hmm. But uh, mm-hmm. but yeah, so um, it, whatever you do, please be safe out there because it's, it's, it gets wild. Uh, for whatever reason, when you drink tequila, it impairs your ability to drive and, oh. or walk or talk. To or, function. It, really, it, unless you're Brad, and then but it, it sh- really fast forwards your ability to get in fistfights and wind up in in jail. <laughs> All the good shit. Yeah, you know? and like the song, it makes your clothes fall off. It makes your clothes fall off. Mm-hmm. Good night out. Sounds, sounds like a good men night out. And women. Mm, sounds like great night out. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the mask? <laughs> <laughs> you guys, uh, why are you putting it on me? I didn't do anything. Nah, I should have wore the mask the whole time. Um, you guys, uh, another huge announcement. Our season finale is coming up. We haven't made an exact date, uh, but we're going to take a few weeks off to work on next season and some other podcasty things that we've been brewing. We just haven't had an opportunity to work on. So, yeah, we're going to take a little bit of time off. Um, pod, pod. There'll still be stuff happening on Wednesday nights, but it'll be uh, reruns and things like that. Podcast. When do I need to have the tarantulas? <laughs> That'll probably be uh, at the very season finale. Maybe the season finale. Maybe, maybe. We, we already got the scorpions. I think. I think next Wednesday works for us, right? Yes, next Wednesday. Show up yeah. here, and, uh, here and eat some bugs. Yeah, I, I don't see any ants. <laughs> hey, oh. we ta-da! The anyway. alliance won. The alliance won. Um, there, there are people that want to see Brad and Jordan eat scorpions. So we'll do that. Uh, one thing I'll let out of the bag, because I meant to mention this last week on our uh, on our shameless plugs, but I skimmed right over it. Is uh, we're working on some on some proper game shows. Uh, we're brought we're, we Jordan and I are huge fans of uh, of like the Game Show Network, which shows all these yes. vintage game shows from like the seventies and, nice. and earlier. Um, so we're, we're the one that we're working on currently is is the uh, the original Match Game. Oh, geez. What about the right? with uh, Gene Rayburn? Uh, um, be so fun. So uh, I, I'm working all those all those things out. We're collecting all those dumb questions, uh, and we're just trying to figure out how that's all going to go. We have some others uh, that we're working on, so that's coming. Uh, but we just need to we need to take a break to work on that stuff. And if any of our big fans out there have any suggestions, yeah, for on game, game shows. shows they would like us to play thinking, or entertain. I think Brad strapped down and like tarantulas put on him. Fear yeah. Factor. So, yeah, so Fear, Fear Factor. factor. Yeah. And I said the 70s. I think that would be awesome. <laughs> Jams anyway. and Cocktails, Fear Factor. Yeah. So, uh, so that's going on. We'll post more, obviously, about it as the plans develop. That does it for my shameless plugs. I do believe that we promised the guest that we would end on a shot call trivia. Derek's already strapped back in, isn't he? Uh, Derek is already strapped back in. Ugh. God, we don't. I am here for the fans, and when you tell them we're going to do something, we're going to do By it. By golly, you do it. They have spoken. They're all going, shock the fuck out of me. All right. They're all going, Derek, grab the grab the thing and shock Brad again. That was funny. No, I don't think they're saying that at all. No, that, I think they are. No, that was good shit. <laughs> that it's was only fair because Jordan, Jordan double shocked Derek or accidentally shocked yes, Derek. Last uh, time. A while back. Oh, sorry. Okay. I think my neck got fat since. Uh, oh God, it got pinched. <laughs> I know I did. That was horrendous. I, I did the same thing. Which was worse than getting shot. I've got shocked. mine sitting more on the back of the neck. Is that? Yeah, it was worse than the shock. It was horrible. I'm I'm more on the back than the side this time. Oh, you know, so uh, we we had a little message. Um, did you turn yours on? On YouTube. Uh, yeah. One one beep. Yep. Okay. Um. Kim, who I guess is uh, I guess is actually your nephew, uh, on Kim's oh, Derek's is nephew. Is that CJ? 
And uh, he said, you guys should have seen him do the one chip challenge. And I did oh, see the video I only and it was great. It. Oh my gosh. I, I hurt. That was worse than the, than the death nut because it stuck in my teeth. Oh so yeah, man. It's like a, like a, oh, you know, all that. And all it that. tasted so bad. <laughs> he so said, he bad. said he didn't last five minutes. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> You turned a flashlight. <laughs> what setting was that? That's what, what so lame. Was that? Oh my God! Who it, 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 it was low. It wasn't. It wasn't. Uh, all three of us. It was just. The, it was just the scare factor for him. <laughs> oh sure, just the scare factor. It was only like twenty. <laughs> only. I'm sorry, Brad. Hey, it, oh. Your girl handed that to your brother, just hey, so you know. It's our hooligans. It's for our viewers. Oh my god! Oh, oh my, my god! god. <laughs> Seriously, if it happens one more time, I'm done. I will. I will end the show. Viewers, I do you want you put it, it on end? Steve, do you want it to end? I thought yes, you put it on at Steve. this point. <laughs> I no, will. The, no, the viewers are unanimously saying shock Brad more. <laughs> I thought you put it on Steve. Yeah, because the number changed. I thought you put it. Yeah, good try, Derek. <laughs> I honestly didn't know what channel that one was on. It was mine. <laughs> it, it, uh, was uh, it was me. Obviously. <laughs> All right. We're going to get into some uh, questions here, huh? I don't know. I think we are. Everybody's watching. Okay. How do you spell Kashyyyk? Wow. <laughs> I feel like I should get a pass on the on my first I my think first you two might. Rocks. No, no negative no. negative. <laughs> After all the things you've actually put us through on this show, N- negative red five negative. Does anybody remember <laughs> the two times where I was the only name on the freaking roulette wheel? Oh yeah, that was hilarious. No, does and <laughs> I never got a pass. Does anybody remember all the fucked up shit we've done and who came up with it? Oh yeah, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> it was me. <laughs> Okay. Fair. That's fine. <laughs> so what? Like two questions? Yeah, we'll do, we'll do a few. Two? Okay. We'll do a few. A few. All right. First question. What species stole the plans to the Death Star? Wait. What species stole the plans? Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. Which plans? First or the second? The plans. No. No. To the <laughs> Death Star. Uh, I think I know what they're referring to. Okay, put both answers down. Oh. I got it. I know this is right. Because the first ones were, it was a whole movie on it. Oh. And it, it, everybody ready? Every, I can't even talk. No. I'm like, but, but I'm so I, fucked I, up. Man. <laughs> I, I, I think they were, I, I think I know which one they're talking about. It was the second movie where many died. Yes. I guess these plans. Obviously. Yeah. Uh. So. The Boffins. Yeah. A, I didn't know. But the, uh. but the, but the plans were originally stolen by humans. <laughs> the first death star. And Derek said Ewoks. The Boffins Ewoks. was the right answer, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Ewoks? Ewoks. Wow. I said I didn't know. God. <laughs> they were they were part of stealing the plans and... No. Yeah. Not not even close. They were part of they, shutting down they the, shut shield. the shield Shut generator, up. but... <laughs> Same damn difference. Dude, why was he looking at you, Brad, when he came up with that? Okay, what are we on now? 40? Because I look like an Ewok. Uh, 35. You think there were any... But yeah, Jedi go to 40. Ewoks? No, we can go to go to 40. Oh, okay. No, we, we don't I'm have sure to do that. that. No, no, she just put me on 40. We're all on 40. Mm, right. oh. Okay, just oh. leave it on 40 the whole time. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll just and it. it goes up five every time. Okay, I'm putting them all to 40. Oh, my God. Ah! Oh! Wow, you lying sack of shit. Steve. Okay. <laughs> Stove. Okay, wait. Stove. You're really three. I'm really three. And here we go. Everyone who wants to see Derek shocked, now's your time. Oh, nope. No, it's not. Okay. Try it. Let's uh, do the thing. The thing. Oh, yeah. There <laughs> it is. He doesn't even make a sound. Oh, no, right. he did. Mm. His whole back. <laughs> That's only Brad. <laughs> and me on a level one. <sighs> that was delicious. All right. Thank you, Sam. I have some more. Oh, sure. There's more where that came from. What is the nickname of the Wookiee bounty hunter Snuva? 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 No, you got to come up with something better than that. That's my God. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that, you can't even hunter? pronounce his name. Yeah. S-N-O-O-V-A. I don't know. It, it's got to be something we can pronounce. Okay. Well, the answer is 
Okay. No, we don't. Yeah. Know. What's the answer? Yeah. I'm, we don't, Snoopy. I'm, I'm, I'm seriously <laughs> curious. Snoopy. Mad Claw. Mad Claw. That was in the Mandalorian. Oh, okay. Um, no, it was in Boba Fett. Who, I haven't watched Boba Fett. Yeah, I haven't I watched know. Boba yeah, Fett. Yeah, no, neither have I. Who so. killed Han Solo? All right, you guys ready? Double points for both names. Yeah, I was going to say if you can do... Oh. Ben Solo. Kylo Ren, Ben Solo. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, Brad, they technically put Kylo Ren. Well, no, his name is Ben Solo. It's the same person. Yeah, it's the exact same person. Yeah, but it's a different name. <laughs> Don't you dare. He did good. He did good. <laughs> no, what I, are you sticking I, I, up I, for? I will for stand him. up for him since Thank I you. shocked the shit out of him earlier. True. True. Yes, everyone in this room has shocked me. Isn't that funny? That's because we're Isn't shocking. That, uh, we're, yeah, we have electrifying personalities. The truth is, wait, I haven't shocked anybody. Wait, wait a minute. Hold on a second. Whose idea was this? Do you want to have a turn? <laughs> no, I don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> Make sure you put it on one. <laughs> well, well, I'll shut them off. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shock oh, yourself. Oh, oh, Brad. Oh. <laughs> oh. Who, Scandal. Who is Luke Skywalker's most loyal friend, which is also his first mate? What, well, he, is he a boat captain? What, what's going yes, on here? Yes, he is a boat captain. <laughs> the only who, other person in the X-Wing. I've who got is this. Luke Skywalker's most loyal friend, which is also his first mate? All right. This is a tricky one. Yeah, this can only be one way. Cause what do you guys got? He, he, <laughs> R2-D2. He's the, only, R2-D2. he's the only other person in Luke's ship. <laughs> oh. They have that it's Chewie the Wookiee. No, that's Han Solo. That's Han Solo, not Luke Skywalker. It says Luke Skywalker. That's completely wrong. <laughs> Luke Skywalker, Han Solo was on the Millennium Falcon. Well, you're all getting shocked. No, no we're not. That you was- get shocked for Objection. asking the wrong question. Wait, move to strike. Where the hell are you getting these questions from? It is the big quiz thing. Wikipedia. Oh, so somebody has probably never seen Star Wars. <laughs> probably. Yeah, Luke Skywalker, he's a Millennium Falcon captain. Yeah. Shank. Sure. Who Burr. is Chancellor Burr. Palatine's Palpatine. Palpatine's Sith <laughs> alter ego? Bruce should know this. All right, I'm ready. I'm not. Finally, some things I know. I didn't spell it right. But... Right? I'm. I'm. Oh. I'm. I'm... Oh my god. Channeling the force? Yes. Oh my god, is your hand getting away from you? Yes, actually. Yes, Darth Sidious. Darth Sidious. All around. Good job, fellers. Um, hmm. but he is the emperor. Shock Brad anyway. Yeah, right. Because <laughs> he didn't put the emperor. What 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 else is new? Third time's a charm. God. Who was Count? <laughs> Do, Dooku, Doku's, Doku, Doku's, Doku's Padawan <laughs> before he left the Jedi. Oh, jeez. Oh, I ain't spelling the name right, but you got it. Oh, Everybody yeah. ready? Oh yeah. I said Qui- Qui Gon Jinn. Yeah. Oh Qui-Gon. yes. Yeah, Qui-Gon you're right. Jinn. Oh. Yeah. You said before he left the Jedi. Yep. Sorry. Qui Gon Jinn. Oh. Oh. Darth Maul. Hit me. Darth. He said oh, Darth no. Sidious. You're on a 45 now, Derek. Oh, my heavens. Don't touch any of the equipment. Yeah, right? <laughs> Could all go up and <laughs> Yeah, <smoke>. just what <laughs> we need. That's how we get rid of ants. Here we go. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh. He about smacked himself in the head with his own yes, shoulder. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right, Derek, we're over We're over the mark hold where on, it, hold on, you hold wanted. On. Was that a snort? That was awesome. Oh, no. That was, was like, awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, or maybe it was. Could have we're, been. we're over the 40 mark, so we can do one more question. Okay, one more. Yeah. This is it, and it is naming a movie. Which is the first original theatrical Star Wars movie where Jabba the Hutt is seen? Oh, well, hold on now. Yeah. The remakes? Does this or include the, the original movies? Because he was added into a movie. I'm going to say just and, chronologically. And chronologically. For, to, no, year-wise. The actual So release-wise. Re, yes, release-wise. 
Which one was he shown in first? Which yes. one did he make his first appearance? In? Yes. Did everybody see him for the first time? Yes. Okay. I don't like that. I hope I'm right. I, I hope so, too, because <laughs> so he was I. added into older movies. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And he was also um, added into uh, Phantom Menace. Yes. Or not ant- added, yep. but he was in Phantom Menace. Yes. So, well, see, that's uh, what I was going to put. <laughs> all right. What do you guys got? I, just, uh, no, I was about yeah. to put Phantom Menace. but it, Return of I the just, Jedi is the first time he was yeah. shown on screen. I erased Return. I re- erased. You had Return of the Jedi. No, had I had Return. Phantom. Oh, oh. Phantom. Phantom the Menace is the first time he actually appeared in the, in time, the chronological in the order. Yeah. 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 I said Return of the Jedi. It was Return of the Jedi. Yeah. yeah. Right. Derek, you suck. Dude. No, just kidding. We're thinking so deep into this. I know, right? Nerds. <laughs> Nerd. Technically... Well, there's a lot at stake here. Technically, he appeared in The Phantom Menace, which was... Hold my hand. No. Hold my hand. I'm sweaty. Oh, wait a minute. No. Ew. Ooh, do you feel a shock? Oh, oh you didn't even do anything. That's no, because I had it up right here. Oh. I thought you were going to like... Gnarly. All right. So one more? Good, one more. One more. No. Uh, one more? Yeah. We're going to do one more. One more. That's and then it. We'll go out. So I'll make one more. That's what the clapping. This is a. I don't think the crowd wanted one more. <laughs> encore. <clears throat> this is the encore presentation. Okay, here we go. Who was the Jedi Master that ordered to create clones? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Who was the Jedi Master that ordered to create clones? Oh, I got this one. Oh, damn. I'm sure you do. I damn, mean, Steve I remember is... it from the movie. I, 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 didn't, I didn't spell it correctly, but I got it. Because <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen the spelling. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, no, I'm get, no, I'm going to no, take no. the shot. The one, the one Camino said it. I know. Yo, don't give him hints. <laughs> I'm giving you hints, too. Who I, was the I, It starts master with Master. That <laughs> ordered to create clones. I hate this. I'm ready. Let's do this. Wait. Mm. It was, I, I it, was actually, it was actually the that was actually the Emperor's Padawan before Maul. I got I got nothing. What is the answer? Master Sifidius. No. Yes, oh is. yeah. Oh yes, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. She just absolutely. didn't know that's no. how yeah, absolutely it is. Yeah, Sifodius. <laughs> yes. Nope. It's spelt really weird. Jedi yeah. sure. Master Sifo-Dyas. Yep. Now I remember it. Yep. Um, well, Derek, you get your wish, you son of a gun. <laughs> that was nicely I was, put. I was ready to go, and I was going to take shocks until you got one last one. <laughs> God. Okay, you all realize I want everybody out you're there. on 55. I, know, I, I don't want everybody want... out there to look me in the eyes and do this with me. Oh, God. Wow. Right, Derek, so Derek first. Do I do yours less since you got two additional no, ones? No. No. No, oh. no, no, no. I'll play along. Okay. Why are you asking him? He's going to... You took your glasses off like it makes it better or something. It does. <laughs> Can't see shit. Yeah, exactly. Ow. Okay. Here. Dude, you have the shit eatingest look on your face. I know. <laughs> oh, my God. You are the worst. <laughs> oh, heavens mm. to bitsy. Mm. Oh, oh, now it's your turn. Oh. I'm the worst. Oh, here, here comes the real Are reaction. your hands sweating yet? Yes. Oh, no. oh my God! Oh, God. oh zap! <laughs> Turn it on. <gasps> oh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, we lost him. We lost him. We lost him. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we lost him. No, oh, the sheriff fell over. <laughs> Took it off. Yeah, yeah, I can't do Brad again. Uh, I think that's no, what he was trying no, to say. I was trying to say while he was on the ground. You hit him again. That would have been great. You hit him while he's down. <laughs> Start his heart back up. No. You <laughs> Dude, you fell out of the did chair. You, did you do that on purpose? No. <laughs> oh my god. No, I because I, I saw because I saw his hand try to reach up. I think and I broke my whole headphone. And there was oh nothing there. <laughs> Good thing I have extra. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I saw him reach to grab something. Oh my it was god! Like air, and everyone was uh, <laughs> was on the what witness that you were on your screen, so everyone just saw you fucking biff it. They saw the the reach for nothing. Good thing you're wearing pants. Oh my god, you guys! The only thing would have been funny if the TV would have fell off onto him. Oh my god. <laughs> 
That would have been awesome. <laughs> you almost just, made her spit I, on me. Hey, hey, <laughs> I, I would have bought a new TV over just to see that. <laughs> uh, I had to fall and break the TV so we can get a new bigger I, one. <laughs> I didn't know what was going to happen. Oh, my God. Ooh, that, that was, was that was hardcore. That, I feel like, was... Oh, wow. I don't know. That was hilarious. And Derek's just like... Uh. Oh. Well, Ouch, kibibbles. actually, I was more like, hmm. <laughs> I certainly hope everyone's had a great time tonight. I uh, know we just did. <laughs> give it up once again for our destruction crew, Miss Princess Jordy, Qui Gon Derek, and Darth the Bruce. <laughs> oh, guys. Dude. <laughs> Tune in next week for our best yeah. of episode. And of course, uh, we'll be back live on the 18th. Until next time, drink some water, skip the death sticks, support your local cantina band, and uh, may the force be with you. And don't eat cupcakes from st- from friends. And make sure you before you do the princess, she's not your sister. Uh. Mm. <laughs> good, good advice. Mm. <laughs> Broad- <Step>. Broadcasting <laughs> live from the legendary JNC Lounge. I'm Brad Brock. We love you guys. Good night.